morning. Good morning. How are we doing? I found my glasses. So panic over. Go and retweet that. Go on. relaxing dun, 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 dun. i hope you can hear the music because i can otherwise i look mental right now good morning everybody how are we doing are we good what have i missed haven't been here since league one we're in the prem now jordan we're in the prem um i'm i'm I, hello everyone i'm good thank you dandino how are you good morning ryan jordan ollie Good morning, Nightbot, Harry, Dave, CD, 271. Hope you're all good. Leone, how are you? Hope you're well. Have I missed anyone? Ryan again, I've said you. Good morning, all. Are we well? Sunday song vibe. It is Sunday, isn't it? I've realised I've only got one of the lights on. It's kind of like dark in here today. I don't mind it, though. Uh, you look mental, but there was music. Well, we'll, we'll take that, won't we? Uh, it's 9pm, but good morning. Um, are, are you in Aus Australia? That was South African. Australia, mate. That's better. We left the door open. Yeah, the door's open. Um, let me turn down this music a bit. Yeah, the door is open today as we've got a little Lenny dog on the go at the moment. Um, love the teacher chair dancing. Yeah, Lynn Bloom. That's what, I'm, that's what I'm good at. Um, I say good. Yeah, we've got a little Lenny dog here today. He's um, he's a little bit tender because he's had his surgeries. Um, he's wearing his little coat. So I've got him with me because... Um, just because I've got him with me, but he might want to walk out in and out. So I've left it open for him to do that if he needs to. So yeah, the door is open. It is weird having the door open. I'm already hot because of these lights. So this is going to go well, isn't it? I don't know why I've worn this top. Um, morning, uh, Robbie. Morning, Mackenzie. Hope you're both good. Harry, how are you? Fogman, hope you're well, my friend. Lenny Dog on the go like he's squash. No, no, no. no. I mean, I've got him with me. It's like it's my, my parent time, you know? I would show you him, but I don't really want to lift him up and... I don't think the camera can see him where he is. I'll try. I'll try Lenny uh, Lenny Cam. No, see, he's down there, look. Uh, he's there, look. He's there. Oh, there. Can you see his little onesie? Look, he's got his little onesie on, his little baby grow, and he's... um. Yeah, he, he doesn't love it. <laughs> He's very, very good at getting back out of it. I'll tell you that. It's quite incredible. Uh, Noble's Lendog. Yeah, that's him. Yeah, we've got some new emotes, by the way, chat. Enjoy the emotes. If you are subbed here, there are some new emotes. If you're on desktop, I believe it only works on desktop at the moment, the animated ones, but I'm sure they'll change that. We've got, um, there's a Crabs that's animated. There's a Jurassic Park that's now animated. There's a um, We Are Bodies that, that is animated. And then we've also got some new emotes because I could move some of our emotes to the animated ones. I put some new ones in. Um, there's a 442 Mike Bassett one. I mean, go and have a look at them. Have a go at them. When are these moving? Not fly. I don't know. How, how should we make them move? Thing is, we've got, we have five slots for moving emotes for animated ones. and And that's it. Uh, I don't know what I was going to say next there, but that's how many we've got. <laughs> uh, I see coffee. We do have a coffee on the go, chat. If you are drinking coffee this Sunday morning, get your coffees up. There they are. Look, I've gone for this mug today. Liverpool were the champions in 1920. Do not forget it. I'm reminding myself. Uh, <laughs> I hope we're good there. Yeah, I've got a coffee. I do actually also have a squash on the go today. Are you ready for this? Because, because I feel like you're going to be more happy with me today. A little slightly more happy. It's orange. Look, we've got the we've got this the the Hamlet glass, but it is at least orange in and not lemon. So I feel like that's better, right? That's an improvement. I won't have some because I just had some coffee. First coffee of the day. Oh, it hits well. It hits nice, doesn't it? Um, but yeah, how's everyone's weekends going? I hope we're having a good one. I hope we're having a, a nice, chilled, relaxing one before uh, Monday begins. <sighs> just remind you know that feeling when you remind yourself that Monday's soon. I just had that. I was like, oh yeah, it's Monday soon, isn't it? That's a shame. 
But no, um, it's the weekend still. We've got still got it's early morning Sunday. We've still got all of Sunday today. It's all good. Do you want some news from me? Do you want some news from me? If you like watching my YouTube videos, which I love you to bits if you do, I recorded a whole series yesterday. A whole series. So get ready. Get ready. If you like Schalke, get ready. Uh, when you remember England plays soon. Oh, yeah, that's upsetting, isn't it? Uh, West Brom with the winners in 1920. That mug is inaccurate. Excellent, right? Brilliant. Been a good week. Bought yourself a Sony A7 III. Nice, Mackenzie. Very good. How long? It's um a few episodes. Quite. It's a few episodes. Sacked in the first episode. No. No. <laughs> Mock exam started this week and next week. Oh, CD. You're halfway through. Remember that. You're just halfway through and it'll be fine after that. It'll be fine. It'll be, and just do your best. That's all you can do, right? Uh, thoughts on the Euros so far? It's been um, it's been good, isn't it? I like watching football every single day. It's nice. Um, Italy look good. France, oh, France haven't been that great actually, have they? I think Italy have probably been my standout team in terms of how how they've done. Uh, it's hard to tell though, isn't it? Really, it's it's that weird point now where actually a draw in the groups isn't that bad. It's just one of them things. It's like, eh. The England game was um shocking, horrible, uh, awful. Congratulations, Scotland, on your nil-nil draw. Um, but England would abject. So, yeah, it's just one of them. But then again, like even on paper, if the performance wasn't quite like it was, you'd be all right with a draw, I think. And if it wasn't Scotland, you'd be all right with a draw. Usually, we have at least a draw in our group stages, and it's fine. You see, was it um, what France drew yesterday to Hungary? Like, it happens, and it's not that bad. However... It's just one of them because uh, it was Scotland and because it was the it was such a negative performance. It's kind of put a bit of a a, a, a horrible look on the old tournament so far. So just one of them. Just showed why England should be four three four three. Yeah, maybe at least France scored yesterday. You could say, yeah, but like flip that world. France conceded yesterday. England haven't conceded a goal yet. Like it's you know what I mean. Like there's you can always you can always like phrase it in a way that will be different i don't think france drawing to hungary i don't think you can look at that and say well it's better than england drawing to Fr to scotland it's just one of them give scotland a chance to qualify slim chance to qualify but they i guess they do have a chance to qualify yeah wasn't defensive against hungary exactly right it, it, that's what i mean like the it was the negative feel of the whole performance the negative um way that we approached it that made it such a so, so annoying as a as like a fan uh, other than that yeah we had more passion and quality on the night you had far more passion and quality on the night. Well, I disagree with that. Like, you drew nil-nil. Like, far more quality means that you probably win the game. You definitely did have far more quality. Like, it was nil-nil when neither team deserved to win. That's it. That's it. <laughs> like, crap game. Done. Like, I don't know why people are trying to point score with saying Scotland were way better. Scotland weren't way better. Scotland were quite good for them. Uh, Drex, thanks for the follow. It's not the result. If we drew 2-2, attacking most people were happy compared to that. Yeah, exactly, Ollie. I agree with that. Luke Shaw said something interesting that if we drew 0-0 against Croatia and beat Scotland 1-0, no one would be complaining. Horrible perform performance. Exactly, right? It's how you... It, but then tournaments are about that. Tournaments are about momentum and, and, and the belief. Like, England managed to ride a wave in the 2000... And, well, the last World Cup, all the way to the semis because of momentum. They didn't actually play any good football. They didn't even play any good teams. But because of the general feel of the camp, the team cohesion and the momentum that they carried, it was a good tournament. I feel like we've stalled now with that performance against Scotland. We've like, I think the, the Croatia game had built a really good uh, feeling around the England team. And then it's completely stalled after that performance against Scotland. Because, I mean, even if they scraped a 1-0, people would move on and like it'd be fine. Portugal 2016 didn't win a game in 90 minutes. Yeah, exactly, right? But then even then, the good feeling you get from winning an extra time, like that sort of carried them anyway, didn't it? Winning an extra time is actually probably more of a buzz than, than winning in normal time comfortably. Feels worse because it's Scotland. Exactly. It's all about the context, I think, isn't it? Um, Scotland will always find a way somehow to, to not to qualify. I mean, they've, put it, they've got it all to do, haven't they? One point from two games, they've got it all to do. Didn't even play well. They played that poorly. It showed into played into Scotland's hands. They didn't ha have to defend. Yeah, that's kind of it. Like if Scotland played well, I think they had decent chances. I guess um, if Scotland played well, they would have beaten England on that day. So I don't think Scotland played that well. Like England played that poorly, and that so and that obviously and that oh, it was so obvious what they were going to do every single time. Um, that if if Scotland actually played well, I think they win that game. 
And the point, and the, and the thing was, that they didn't even do enough to win the game. It was just, a, it was just a, a, an absolute crap game. Um, 96 Switzerland drew with Ireland. Yeah, exactly. Draws in the group are kind of normal. It doesn't matter as long as you qualify and then you need to perform. Like, I quite like it if England went into this Czech game now and put in a performance um, and then we could take a bit of momentum into the next round. Then again, if we draw to to Czech, to the Czech Republic and, and get an easier draw, then I guess they'd probably see that as a win anyway. Not that they should be counting their laurels. I mean, we all remember with Iceland, right? But um, I think that would actually be a good feeling around the camp anyway. Scotland still to score a goal. Congratulations, Scotland, for... Um, 180 minutes without scoring, but you know, enjoy yourselves. <laughs> Halves, thank you very much for the follow, dude. Welcome in. Anyway, chat, we are, um, I knew you'd want to talk about that. We can chat more about that. It's interesting to see what people are feeling. I feel like I've been uh, burned slightly because my whole Twitter timeline was Scottish fans loving it. And I was like, I don't quite get it. But then again, I'm not a Scotland fan, so maybe I don't understand it, right? Um, who disappointed you most for England? I thought... <sighs> Calvin Phillips was disappointing because I thought he was really dynamic in that Croatia game and I thought he was so safe in in that Scotland game. Um, Kane, surely... You say you say Kane. I don't think we play to give Kane a chance. I think Kane, when he got it, was, was poor. But I think then... We don't play for him. I think it's a little bit scapegoat. I think it's almost pushing towards now that he's, he's avoiding being a scapegoat because everyone's saying he's a scapegoat it, i don't think he was good but at the same time i think he was um i don't think we we, we worked well for him how are you doing in your fantasy uh average i've gone for a thing this i've gone for my um limitless thing for the last group group games uh so i've got uh i'm hoping to get some points now phone and performed disappearing act in both games yeah started well and faded yeah i think i think mount was really poor actually by his standards Sterling was atrocious. I, I think he was, but then I think I don't know. Like they didn't seem to. They, it was it was hard. I don't think anyone stood out. And then without anybody standing out, you don't really know where to kind of like use like where you directing all your play. Who you're giving it to? Like if Sterling's having a great game, you give the ball to him. If you give um, you know, if if Mount was playing brilliantly, you give the ball to him. If Foden's playing brilliantly, you give the ball to him. There are creative outputs. All of them were off. All of them were playing poorly. So we had nothing, and it went from there. I think. Sun has been dreadful. We're not playing into Foden, and Mountain Kane strengths. Yeah, I agree. Double digits, Hutch. Thank you very much for the 10, buddy. Chat, can we get some, uh, can we get some dancing crabs in the chat? The whole attack was bad. Yeah, exactly, Brecken. I think Ming's been quality. Ming's been really good. Great defensively. He's been really good in the air, which I've been, that's the main thing. He looks dominant in the air, which is good. Fullbacks were not pushing on and both DM sitting is an issue. 100% Pav, yeah. It's so negative, isn't it? And, Oh, it's just Southgate, isn't it? It's so obvious to say that, but I wanted there to be a change. I wanted there to be a, a thing to take the game to them. We'll switch it. Right, we'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to drop Mount into the midfield. We're going to bring this. That's what I, I wanted, like, a thing to happen, and then there just wasn't. Uh, why are Lenny's ears bigger? Lenny's ears aren't. That's just Lenny's ears. I haven't changed Lenny's ears. They're just That's just the size of them. He just has big ears. Um, do you bring in Maguire for wing uh, for Mings or Stones or into a three? Uh, I think that's tough, uh, Robbie, actually. I'd be loath to change Mings right now. And I don't rate Mings, but it's difficult to change him after the way he's performed. He's been good. He's like, really good. We've not conceded a goal. He's not put a foot wrong. He's had a few scary moments, but that is Tyrone Mings. But no, I think he's all right. I do wonder if Stones' header went in with that change of the game. Oh, 100% CJ, yeah. 100%. If the Stones header goes in, the rest of the game plays out pretty much exactly the same. And you're saying, Gareth Southgate, brilliant. The two holding midfielders were perfect, you know. We kept it tight. We kept a clean sheet. Won the game 1-0. Professional job done. Move on. Right? That That's what you could say. But it didn't go in. And then we didn't change. And that's the thing. Like, we, we kept trying to do the same thing that was clearly not working. Sancho hasn't had a minute so far. But like, you know, we're, we're leaving Foden on where he's doing nothing. We're, we're not changing Matt. We're not doing anything that's changing anything. Kane hasn't had a touch. He's probably had about 16 touches across two games. And yet, when we needed a goal, we did nothing. Was that was he scared to lose? Was he okay with the draw? I actually feel like he might have been okay with the draw, which in tournament football, I think he's trying to do his tournament football thing, but I think he's 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 negating the effect that the, the goodwill and the the atmosphere around the camp and the and the the, the fans behind them. It's, it's a home tournament pretty much, isn't it, right? 
I wonder if that's if that's what he's just negating there by taking the draw. Isn't using Sancho's borderline offensive. Hope Sancho has an Irish granny or something. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I think it's uh, too late for that though, right? How many leaders are there in the dressing room? Well, in the dress... Uh, that shouldn't be an issue. It really shouldn't be an issue. What's your thoughts on getting second and getting an easier round of 16 draw? It's just risky, isn't it? Like, it'd be nice. It'd be nice to go into that Czech Republic game and think a draw and then get a nice easy draw. But then it's risky. It's, I don't really want to play like that. Again, I want to go in with winning all these games. Anyway... Anyway, I think um, I think we've covered most stuff there. Hopefully, um, hopefully you agree with what I'm saying there. I don't know. I, it's, it's, I love talking football with you guys. Though. It's fun. That's why we do these little just chatting bits at the start of the stream. We are going to play some Football Manager today, though. If I uh, go across to Football Manager and hopefully this loads up. Um, the current situation is... Come on. Come on. There it is. The current situation is we're fifth in the league. At the end of last stream, we jumped up to fifth in the league. 33 points, as you can see. And we're looking good. We're in 20 games into the season. So we're over the halfway point. And, and yeah, FM to ruin your mood. Exactly. Exactly a bit of FM to ruin your mood. Should I turn this light on? Is it plugged in? It's not plugged in. I can't turn it on anyway. We'll stay like this. Um, get a nice easy draw. We just drew with Scotland. Exactly right. Get a nice easy draw. We drew with Scotland. We went out to Iceland once by doing that. <laughs> hey, Ollie. Ollie, thank you very much for the six. You've gone gold badge, my friend. Chat, you know what to do. Get some dancing crabs. Get some Lennies in there. Thank you. You're kind of faking this fifth with uh, with Brighton's game in hand. Yeah, that's true. They win theirs, they go back above us. But the main thing is we are in these European places. We're in the top six, which is what we need to be. We need to be in the top six because we've, we've done it before where we've not finished in the top six and it was a mistake last season, right? Is this music loud? Is this music level good? It feels loud in my ears. I'm not sure. Yeah, the crabs move now. So if you're a sub, get get your, get your dancing crabs out. Weird sentence. We've won our last four games, chat. One of them was Peterborough, and we kind of scraped it. But we've won our last four games. Not that one. This one. Newcastle 3-2. I mean, we've won 4-2, 3-2, 2-1, 3-2. We are still conceding. Um, We've got Leicester who are 19th, Brighton 6th. Oh, we actually played them. They're in the uh, the top few places as well. Burnley, and then, then the FA Cup game. It's not too bad a run of games, that. They are the games that we usually slip up on, though. So let's see. Let's see. We've got a couple of days now before the Leicester game. Um, we are in January as well. So there might be some movers or some shakers. We might need to look at some players today. Um, yeah, we did try to draw 5-5 five, five with Leeds, Andrew. It was mental. Who knows? Hungary... Hungary, oh, what did you say about Hungary drew with France yesterday? Yeah, they did. They did. Portugal getting slapped by Germany was an entertaining game. It was a really good game. Uh, our games today, we've got Italy, Wales, right? And Wales are through already. So that's a little less tasty than it would have been, right? Um, yeah, so the crabs the crabs move and Jurassic screams. He does. Forkman, thank you very much for the four, buddy. Appreciate you. Chat again. Get your emotes in there. Do it. Uh, Zeon says, I've got Hereford save going. Currently about to start my second season in the championship. This is more just this morning saw a video about the work permit search. They're so looking to get some players, decent players. Oh, Zeon, it's like a game changer. Um, it does slightly depend on what type of Brexit you've got, but you should be able to, well, even doing that filter, you'll be able to find some better players there, definitely. So good luck. I did two seasons in the championship as well, actually. Uh, Sector, thank you for the follow. Uh, Italy, Wales, fight for top. Switzerland, Turkey, fight for third. Yeah. Okay. Ollie, I understood what you meant. 403rd day you've written. But yeah, I get you. I get you. We're a great squad, but Southgate has no credentials and produces performances on par with Steve Bruce. So I don't I don't always mind the way that Southgate sets up originally. I don't mind the way that we start games. I mean, he looks great. I don't think he's dynamic enough to change things after it's not going right. I don't think he knows what to do. In those situations, not that I know what to do, but sometimes it seems obvious, right? It seems get Grealish into the game here and then he'll wait and wait and wait and then Grealish comes in and, and actually things start to happen. It's just, mm. um, oh, that's not good. We are in a bit of financial trouble here. I'm not quite sure why, but we are in debt. It's because JJ just gave us loads of extra wages. We've got Poland. Do you remember we signed Pole on the last, uh, on the, in the last stream? Um, we're in a bit of financial mud. I'm sure it's going to be fine, especially if we qualify for Europe. But yeah, 
Bryson Phillips doesn't work when we control possession. No. You say that though. We were quite we control possession quite a lot against Croatia as well. But yeah, maybe against those teams that are proper, proper sitting in. Yeah, we did get Paul Ollie on loan um, to start with. He's on loan. We're paying his wages. He wasn't registered for Barcelona. So we've managed to swoop in and get him on loan. You can't go bankrupt in the Premier League. Finances will be fine. Exactly right. That's what I'm thinking. I think it's just our wages are quite high. But as soon as it'll sort to of level out as if we do better, we'll get more money, etc, etc. Um, you bankrupted the club by getting a loan of a pole. Uh, yeah, kind of, kind of. Scoops, welcome in, buddy. How are you? I am well, thank you, my friend. Let's have some... Should we do coffee first? Let's do coffee then, squash. Like a Sunday morning. I've always thought if, if me watching from the TV can see something isn't working, how can he not? I think... I think it's very easy. I've, I've thought this uh, before, you know. I've thought this before, but I think it's very easy as a, as a fan to say, right, get him off, get Grealish on. But you're then not thinking, right... Like, what if... You're not thinking of the, the the negative effects of that saying. What is that player doing that is negating the other team sometimes? And, like, it's very easy for us to throw that away if it's not our jobs on the line. If that making that change then is the reason that we concede because we throw on Grealish and he doesn't track back this one player and, you know, Sterling was doing that brilliantly before. Maybe we're not quite thinking of the whole picture, but you're right. Sometimes it does just seem obvious, doesn't it? Um, right, I'm going to reject these until... Did we say we're going to loan anyone? You get the money back by finishing prize money. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Sterling was doing nothing to benefit any anyone. Yeah, but right, you say that. Like, you don't actually know, do you? Like, like you, don't, you don't know enough about coaching football to know that. But, I like, not that I don't agree, but that's definitely the thought process behind a, um, a manager. Very easy to say what to do as a fan because we face no con consequence. Yeah, right. How would everyone feel Eddie Howe as England manager? It's a style of football is, is painful under Southgate. I have an A license. Well, congratulations. You're not the England manager. I can't stand Southgate as West Ham fan. All I can say is look how we've massacred my boy while watching Rice. Oh, no. Uh, England just don't seem to move the ball or press. They don't seem to be doing anything. Um, love Eddie Howe as a Bournemouth fan, but he wouldn't fit international football. I'm not sure about how. I don't know what... Like, I just feel like I don't know what Southgate did to get the job. <laughs> like, where's his pedigree? He, he like, did he do he, he, like a good UEFA Cup run with Middlesbrough? Oof. <laughs> Give it super Scotty Parker. I'm thinking his style of football with world class footballers. Be Lampard next. See, that's scary in itself, isn't it? It's a weird one. International football management is a weird one. Like, it, it's very different. You can't just uh, appoint a good club manager. Cameron does not show the whole pitch. A lot tactically is unseen. Exactly 2-7. Yeah, 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 exactly. We might be getting Parker. Bournemouth might be getting Parker, yeah. What do I say to you in here, by the way? If I just see if Jurassic can solve it first. He won't be able to. Oh, he oh get in, Lucas. Go on, Jurassic. Just find a super attacking manager. What's the worst that can happen? Uh, we're, we're defensively inept is probably the worst that can happen. Um, but yeah, I get the, I get the thinking. Didn't Southgate do the under-21s before Boothroyd? Uh, I think so. Not be... Yeah, that's how he got it. Basically, Allardyce was an idiot and that's how he got the job. Tell him dressing room leader. Oh, I, I just, just left it. it. Ollie, it worked out on its own. Next time, it'll probably come up again. I'll probably have to do that, won't I? He replaced Big Sam and got two wins and then the FA realised that he was cheaper than anyone else. Yeah, probably. They probably spent a lot on getting like Big Sam in and then, then getting rid of him and then they just needed to get someone who was cheap, maybe. And then he did okay at the World Cup and then he's just stayed. Um, Cuisance in the team of the week. Oh, he's actually joining, chat. Do you remember the... Um, do you remember the... The free transfer that we looked at and he doesn't look great. He's an 18-year-old Belgium centre-back. Doesn't look amazing. Good physicals, but PSG were in for him. And basically Inter and, and Juventus and City and everybody... We've offered him a wage and he's actually joining us if he gets a work permit. So that's pretty good. I feel like we can definitely at least make money off him. So he's in. Um, Benny wants to leave. Right, Sunday, can you sort this out? Right, no. He's not good enough to be a regular player. No, he's definitely not. At least DCI would play. He's awful. Uh, imagine Big Sam with our attacking options. Yeah. To be fair, a lot of the English players are highly overrated IRL and definitely in FM. Um, probably to a certain degree. Release, says Pav. This is Benny Ashley. See you, everybody. He nearly scored. 
in a cup game this year. He's had two appearances. Release the seal back into the wild. We can't, can we? We had the easiest run to the final ever in the last World Cup, yet we still didn't make the final. Played one good side and lost three times. People overhyped that World Cup. We failed. Oh, Brady, I agree. I agree. It was all about the... Um, it's the feeling around it, though, wasn't it? The getting that... Like, I agree, though. I, the, how we didn't beat Croatia, man. How we didn't win that game. 1-0 uh, up as well. That's, again, do you have a manager that knows what he's doing a bit more? Imagine Mourinho. Like, OG Mourinho in that situation. 1-0 up. Trippier scores the free kick. That finishes 1-0, that Croatia game, doesn't it? <laughs> Ashley still deserves to be starting. I'm not sure. I might just ignore him and hope this goes away. Like, mate, you are stealing a living. You're on you're on £3,000 per week doing nothing. Just relax, yeah? You're 30. No one's going to play you any, any, anymore. You're going to lose your pace. That's the only thing you've got. Just relax. Or came past the Sterling. Yeah, well, he's offside, wasn't he? That last World Cup, take out the Panama game. We scored one goal from open play. I know, I know. That's wild, isn't it? Um, all right, we've got our first game today. Sterling was offside. Yeah, I think so. Just can't ignore the leader. Can I not, Ollie? I think I can. I think I can. I think it's fine. We might have even finished 2-0 with Mourinho. Counter goal on the 85th. Yeah, true, true. Can we see the Leicester squad? You can see the Leicester squad, yes. The Leicester squad looks like this. I'll go to tactics. Um, quite a lot of these players are going to be regens, of course. But their striker is Erlers. He's a real player. We've got Harvey Burns. Chemansky, he's real. Samesko, he's real. Samas Samasaku. Mourinho lost his touch. Yeah, no, that's what I meant. That's why I said OG Mourinho, wasn't it? Benny's on 48k a game. He is actually, yeah. Exactly. Stay around, Benny. If you play your one game, it's payday, mate. Payday for you. All right, um, let's do this team. I can't remember. It's been a while, hasn't it? Who do I need in this squad? Aziz for midfield. Sinchek for defense. Alameli's our left back cover, isn't he? Oh, yeah, I remember. We were selling Gomez, weren't we? Gomez has got a £60 million bid from Beijing, and he wasn't interested, but if they offer him big wages, he might go. We might be back in the money very soon, actually. I forgot that was happening. Freddie Welly is not quite back, but could be back. Oh, we played Godinez at right back, didn't we? I thought Magic Mike was their keeper. Um, was he before? No, they've got Gasparini. Gasparini's played loads for them. The last few times we played, anyway. Uh, they've got Loris Karius as their backup, so no. Why don't you put your wingers a bit up so it's 4 2 2 2? Because uh, I like them here. Um, chat, use the emote. What what formation do we play here? Use the emote, see? I feel like Kane is a real issue as well. He doesn't seem to lead on the pitch. He can't demand the ball from his position and make something happen. I am ultimately infuriated by the way that we're using Harry Kane and the way that Harry Kane is playing for us. It's a, it's an issue. It needs to... It need, It's an issue. It needs sorting because he's our best player. And he's playing like our worst player. That that maybe comes down to the management and the, and the tactics a bit. At the same time, I don't know. Is there something going? He looks off it as well, though. Generally, even when he gets the ball, he looks he looks off it. Do your winger score goals right now? Um, yeah. Five from left wing, from right wing. Four from left wing. We're scoring plenty of goals. We're doing quite well. I don't really want to change the tactic, Magnus. It's fine. We're we're literally fifth in the league. We're doing all right. He doesn't look fit. He doesn't, does he? Let's drop our only world-class footballer. Surely, um, consistently disappoints in big games. Sure, Kane is our best player. Uh, not for England, um, Wolves. I, I, he's our best player. Going by, he literally... How many assists and goals did he score this year? He's our best player. But he's not playing like our best player. You think DCL would be better for the moment at, for England? <sighs> like, I actually had a thought the other day, and this was like a very um, emotional reaction to it. But I was like, get Sterling as a false... Like, put Sterling in behind... Or even Rashford, and and then get, get then get Mount Foden and Grealish on the pitch. Do something like that. Foden will be our star player. Oh yeah, he hasn't been though, has he? Literally four wins in a row. This is not the time to change formation. I know, right? I'm just asking you because I play four two two right now and consider playing you. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, all good, Magnus. No, I, I quite like. It seems like on this FM, the deeper wide midfielders are quite effective. 
especially if you have them as like ball carriers. So I've got them as wingers and they carry the ball and they end up in these positions anyway up here. So I actually think this is quite nice like this. I, I For some reason, these deeper wide midfielders, wingers um, are really effective this year. So I quite like it like this. All right. Is this the team? Do I put Freddie Welly back on there? He's not fully fit. Mm, I'll leave him out. Oh, Finley Burns is back. Oh, hang on a minute. Why are we playing? Burns is back for Yoon then. Okay. Thank you for the follow. Uh, Bay Hudson, welcome in. And Eagle before that, thank you for the follow. Okay, maybe the best player, but it's a team game. If he's not contributing to the team, then swap him to someone else. I just feel like the risk of that is you bring Dominic Calvert-Lewin in for Kane and then Dominic Calvert-Lewin does absolutely nothing in that game because we're still playing the same way and it's a, like, a system issue. And then... Where, where does that leave Kane? Like, after that game dropped in a major tour. Like, is that worth doing, you know? Sinchek right back. Um, do you know what? That's probably a good idea. Sinchek was missing the last game, wasn't he? Let's do Sinchek right back. We could... And then we'll go like that. All right, let's do it. Oh, Pole's lacking in match sharpness. I did not realise that. Oh, well. What if TCL comes in and scores a hat-trick? I mean, that's the flip side, right? That's the flip side. Absolutely. He takes so much attention away from the defenders. Um, yeah, possibly. I don't know. I'm not the England manager. I don't know. I, I just want... I don't mind... I want to start Kane, but I want to be quick on changing it. And I want I want a plan B. Uh, we should have England play a super attacking style. If we win, we win. If we lose, we get an easier draw. That's Now is the time to go for it. I would agree with you, actually. Now is a decent time to go for it with this Czech Republic game lose the game and do we still are we still going to qualify if we lose the game or is there a very real th threat of going out if we lose the game so we finished third i think right but are we going to be one of the top four third places if we lose the game we will qualify we have four that's what i'm kind of thinking but so now is the time to go for it i think if we go for it we beat the czech republic anyway but yeah oh patrick arojo scores there you go there you go, Magnus. Winger scoring goals. It's taken 16 minutes. He smashed it in. With four, you're secured. Okay, cool. Um, I say give Sinchek a lot of game time as well as Betrayed as signing a new deal. That's true, actually, Ollie. If he does well, no right back needed. Ollie, I like that as a plan. You know, invest in our players rather than low knees. I always kind of like to like to kind of prioritize that anyway. You're probably correct. It's Scotland who have to not lose, yeah. Scotland need to win, really, right? Because if they draw, they're going to have two points and they're out. They need to win and beat Croatia. And beating Croatia puts Croatia in sticky situation then, is it? Jurassic? Hope it's just a goal Kane needs to start firing a penalty. Could really help him out. But yeah, Bay probably. I agree sometimes in these situations. Big tournament as well. Strikers are very um, anxious to get off the mark, aren't they? on Cuisance. Oh, finish from Cuisance. Come on. And there you go. Speedy in with the nine months as well. Speedy, thank you, buddy. Welcome back, dude. Thank you for the, the resub. Appreciate you. Only thing that stood out in that last Scotland game is Trippier needs to play. Our set piece was so poor. Mount was so poor from corners, right? And do you know what? That makes me think Southgate was right getting him into the team somehow. It means that imagine we had Trent, right? It's oh, but yeah, no, you're right. Mount's corners were woeful. What's your goal for the season? Top four. Um, top six, Magnus. Top four would be beautiful as we've moved into the top four there. But top six generally would be would be a real real um result. The way that we we are inconsistent. We're in a good spell right now, but um we've been very inconsistent. <laughs> yeah, Ollie. Jurassic. I want to see some emotes, chat. I want to see some emotes. Come on. Ready. You've got a screaming Jurassic emote now. Get him in there. Look at that. It's a good finish. We've nicked it here. Barrios oh, nicking the ball oh. into Jurassic with 3 0 up inside the first half. Look at those. Look at those T Rexes. <laughs> so good. So good. What other emotes do we want to animate? Do you like the animated emotes? Do you want me to. Or, or, or do you want to keep them as non, non animated? Do we like those? I think they're cool. Um. You can still tell that's Jurassic Park, right? Yeah, you can. 3-0 um, at half time. We are doing beautifully right now. 
Didn't you battle last uh, first game? Yeah, we did. They're, they're really poor this year, Ollie. They're 19th in the league. Um, looking like they might get relegated. They've got a couple of players with relegation release clauses as well. So we will be vulturing them if they do go down. Them and Newcastle, really struggling. Newcastle did get promoted last year. So maybe you can kind of expect that one a bit more. Um, but yeah, I think we beat them. Was it 5-1? I need to make subs. This whole midfield is knackered. Um, let's do... Who do I want to get on this pitch, more importantly? I'd like to get Mario on. I'm just thinking, do I drop Pepe into a midfield spot? There. <laughs> I found sounded very Jamie Carragher there, didn't I? There. Didn't notice Jurassic was animated until I looked on the chat box. Nice. Um... Maybe Gruber run up, up run out up front it might be a, a, a more of a worthwhile change. Gruber's been really good recently, but we put um, put Jurassic back in. I suppose he has scored, so it's kind of been worth it. All right, so he's done nothing in 10 minutes. Barrios needs to come off now. He's ran his race. So Beltran on there. I think last change will do, do a Rojo for Mario. Twitch hates mobile users. Apparently, yeah. I'm sure they'll update that. That'll be like a, a thing they'll do. Um, all right. Three changes. Quite early on my three changes here. But I feel like we're just seeing the game out. Oh, we could have another one here. Is Beltran in the box. Sincek. What's his performance? But 6.6 .6 at right back from Sincek. So not great. But we've kind of struggled for ratings at fullback anyway. Go on, Pole. Pole winning the ball back. Just keep the score like this. All right, J-Pro. I'll try my best. There is a highlight now, though. Cuisance. We're building. I like early subs. It means you get a better run out of your players, and your players get a nice rest, I guess. Gruber. Wide. J Pro, it doesn't, it's not gone in. I've had withdrawal symptoms from FM. Been at my brother's for a week and not had my computer. EJ, I remember. I remember those feelings. It's been a while since I've had withdrawal. I play a lot of FM these days. Um, but I remember, like, like as a kid... Like, itching to get back home to play FM. Oh, those are the days. We're just seeing the game out. I'm getting flashbacks of the Leeds comeback. Don't. Don't, Ray. <laughs> yeah, when we drew 5-5. Five, five. Oh, Paul has been a bit of a bit of a beast at the back. That's a couple of highlights where he's just, like, snuffed out a chance there, isn't he? It's good stuff from Paul. Are we nicking this? We are getting it back. Paul, nice little ball into Cuisance. Jurassic, terrible pass. Weird highlights going on now. Paul with the header away again. Nothing's getting past him today. Cuisance, Gruber, Jurassic. Oh, he's done it again. <laughs> it's 4 <-0. laughs> Come on. There they are. Knopfler's done it. Ollie's done it. There they are. Coming through. I think the F1 starts at 2 p.m. today, boss. Thank you, Ryan. I was going to ask. Um, We've got... um. Max on pole, right? I did watch the, like, it was on at the same time as the Portugal game, wasn't it? The uh, qualifying. I did manage to watch the the last laps as Max got pole. Prediction gone again. I'm sorry. J-Pro as well. Your prediction's gone there. It was going to go 4-0. It's, it's gone. 4-0 win, though. First game of the stream. That puts us up into the top four. We've got games in hand, so maybe it's not quite our position. But we are in the top four. This is something we cannot underestimate. We just need to keep this run going as long as we possibly can. Come on. Um, Max got pulled, but he won't stay there for too long, I feel. Is it? Will he not? If you were predicting, chat, so F1 fans, you know what I'm like with F1. I'm more of a casual. I'm not, not claiming to be anything else. But um, if you were predicting the, the top three for today's race, what would you go for? Who, 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 what's the podium for today's race? Just got a regen named Dick Coburn. Instant sign. Absolutely, it's the DM. Absolutely, get him in. A weird thing to say. Hamilton, Max Perez. Rye would go for. Yeah. Perez has come good recently, hasn't he? Impressive from him. Oh, right. We're getting rid of Jimenez in a second. What is the wage budget? We're only just over the wage budget. We're fine here. We are good. Hamilton, Max Perez. Hamilton, Max Bottas. Hamilton, Max Norris. Go on, Lando. Hamilton, Max Perez. I think Mazepin will spin. Yep. I think you probably correct. He spun yesterday in qualifying, didn't he? 
The, the only reason I know that is because of the, the Twitter account did Mazapin spin. And then they tweeted yes. Um, right, Damian Jimenez is gone, by the way. He was a good a good servant for us, was Jimenez. Played 82 times for us over the course of four seasons. We, we lost a bit of money on him, but I think he was very, very useful. In that season, we got promoted. And then into the first season in the Prem, he was a really strong, really important player for us. Um, so goodbye, Damian. I don't think he did yesterday. Did he not? Okay. It's, the, it's an end of an era. Oh, Sonoda did, did he? I don't, see, I didn't watch much of it. I just saw the Twitter account. Maybe that was an old one. Um, I'm going to reject that. It's the end of an era. It is kind of the end of an era with him going. It does mean that we are good on the wage budget, though, which means we should be good with the board across pretty much everything. We are also up to an A+. Plus. This is nice, isn't it? Predicted to brave uh, battle bravely against, <laughs> against relegation. We are in the top four. We're doing all right. Uh, Mystic uh, Sabero, thank you very much for the follow. And Rostislav before that, thank you for the follow too. Welcome in, gang. Um, what are we doing on follows, actually? What are we what are we close to? What are we close to? Six K soon? Is that the next big one? What are we on? Five thousand eight hundred and six. We're getting there. We're edging towards it. Um, remember to look at loan left backs. So you could loan at Alamele. Yeah, Ollie. I feel like. You're on it today. I appreciate you. You are on it with the the narrative. You get the you get the save. I feel like I've been away from it too long that and now I need to rely on you to tell me what to do. <laughs> um, nearly 6k. That's true. Also, we hit 3,800 subscribers on YouTube, so we are nearing towards 4k there as well. Uh, are these loan? These are transfer listed players that we could potentially loan. We've got some loan slots available. We could maybe try and loan someone for the end of the season. Renan Lodi is listed. He's 30, but... Would he be worth loaning in? He doesn't look all that, but he's so he's, re, he's quite solid across the board. I like Renan Lodi as a player. He's on 95k a week. Depends what they want, really, doesn't it? So 57k. Is he rubbish, Magnus, for you? I quite like him on FM. So we could probably do this, but we'd need to... um, Not quite yet, but we could probably loan him. It's quite expensive, though. Um, really, we want like a youngster, don't we? <clears throat> can play left mid. He can, yeah. Uh, according to the Telegraph, City are expected to make a £94 million bid for Grealish. That's the end of Sterling then. That's also, that would explain a lot about why Grealish is, um, why, why Villa are going out and trying to sign everybody. Like Smith Rowe, etc. And and uh, they were linked with Ward Prowse and everything as well, weren't they? Hey, Lee, thank you very much for the two months, buddy. Chat, you know what to do. Thank you, dude. Hope you're good. Thank you for uh, returning for a second month. That's my favourite resub. Appreciate you. Let's just do a, um, let's just see who's good in terms of attributes instead then. Maybe there's someone who comes up instead here. Okay. Uh, Villa got Buendia. Yeah, they've already bought Buendia. That's Grealish's replacement. Then they've bid for Smith Rowe. They've bid for um, Ward Prowse. It's like they've got rich owners. So the Villa fans are like, it's just because we've got rich owners. Whereas everyone else is like, it's because Grealish is going, isn't it? Um, so yeah. So if you look, why has he got such a, a bad scout report? I guess he's not great. That's why. Lodi is probably the most the most solid one who's this guy 32 is he not very good don't think one is instead for Grealish I think if they sign somebody else I think it would be that um favorite resub on bingo yeah exactly right all good CD enjoy yourself um I'll catch you soon dude um oh these might not get work permits anyway Look at Tavares for me, please. Uh, was he on there then? Sorry, I, I've gone off him now. You're here just like, oh, good, Leone. Don't worry about it. Doesn't Buendia play on the right, though? He kind of plays in any of those three, I guess. But for Norwich, he does, yeah. First, I'm watching what's going on in this save. Brewster, this save. We are a Hereford. It is a Hereford save. We have taken Hereford from the National League North all the way up now to... I'm in the way now on this camera. That's bad, isn't it? I'll just move myself, ready? There you go. 
We've taken ourselves all the way from the National League North up to the Premier League in, is it nine seasons? This is season number nine. And um, this is currently what's going on. You can see in the bottom over there, look. You see our journey of where we've been promoted and where we stayed. Uh, we had two seasons in the Championship. This is our third season in the Premier League now. I'm just ahead. I am. I don't know why this is... I can just go wherever I want. Sorry, that was a bit much there. Sorry about that. Um... <laughs> It was an overall option, not not on, on the attributes. He was an overall... Yeah, yeah, okay. Um, I'll have a look at him. Never seen Clayton's legs. Might be a mermaid. You definitely have seen my legs. But yeah, welcome in, Brewster boy. Hope you're good. Um, these are the most... Ugh, I don't really want any of them. I don't really want any of them. Let's look for... Um, let's Instead of looking for transfer listed, let's look for loan listed. Go for maybe something slightly better. Not a mermaid. There was that Twitter leg thing. Exactly. See? You've seen my legs. I'm not getting them out now. This isn't that part of Twitch. Do animated uh, emotes only work on this stream or do they work on every stream? They should work on every stream, right? Senior crab sticks. That's the name, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, they work on every stream. I do believe. The same as just normal emotes. Uh, late morning. Hello, Kokota. Welcome in, buddy. How are you feeling about your game this afternoon? This evening? Five o'clock, isn't it, right? So, this afternoon, this evening. Um, okay, well, there's apparently none of those. That's great. There's just no lone listed left back. Oh, there is. There we go. They're not very good. Alejandro Bello is the... Oh, we looked at these last stream, didn't we? They're kind of... Eh. Not really worth it. They would be backups, though. They take Alamele's place. This guy's on quite a bit of... No, he's not. It's just not very good. Yeah, there's not really anybody. There's, 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 yeah, nothing to lose. Yeah, we were kind of saying that earlier. Um, just go and put, try and get a, put in a performance against Italy, isn't it? Did I rest the players? No. Tuesday, Saturday. It'll be fine. They'll be fine. All right, let's continue. Let's go and play. We've got Brighton away from home as our next game. We're hopefully signing this Leo Mir at the end of the season on a free. Um, yeah, that'd be cool. Despite having Donnarumma, I want Big Kiefer to score. I've got Donnarumma as my keeper, actually, as well, yeah. Weirdly confident, think we could squeak out a draw against them. I think you could. Especially with them. They're going to change. They're going to rest players, aren't they? I think Wales will probably change a few players as well. Um, but yeah, once you qualify, it seems silly not to win a tournament. Just bring in a few of the other players. But yeah. That's why we could see some weird, weird results in these last, this last round of games. Because the teams are going to change. Which is why on Fantasy, I'm like, Ugh, I don't know if to pick these players because like, are they going to play if they're already qualified? Don't know. I'm sure like the, the, main, the main men will. We're, oh, yeah. Brighton are doing all right, aren't they? Brighton are six. Any other pre-contracts to look out for? Um, not really. We did have a look. There's not really. Gomez has rejected Beijing. That was our money move. What did they offer him? They didn't offer him that, did they? He's wanted by Wolves now. A £60 million bid. Oh. Savio to score evens odds. Leads in the cup. It was fun while it lasted. Yeah, he'll definitely score, yeah. Um, So we've actually got the bid to loan him. Will they just pay his wages? I'm happy they, they can have him if you just pay the wages rather than this. He's on 30k a week. Important player. See, they won't pay his wages. I, I will look really quickly. I know that people enjoy a good uh, pre-contract. We will have a quick look just for players that are uh, contract expiring. Wolves won't pay half of it exactly, right? So I don't, we're not getting that out of Wolves. We need another Chinese club to come in. We can still potentially finish first, second, and third. So difficult to pick between resting players or going all out. Yeah. It, it, that's why it's probably going to be a mix between two, isn't it? A bit of a hybrid of, of all of those things. Oh, Odson Edwards there. He's 30. This guy's there. He's not that good. Malcolm at Arsenal. 
30k a week is almost double what they than what they offered. Yeah, well, I don't want to let him go on loan unless they're going to pay his wages. Livakovic is there as a keeper option, but he's 34. Martial. These guys are now... These weren't interested, quite a few of these, that are now interested. Like Jack Grealish at 33. Pedro Conchalves. Yeah, we looked at Conchalves. Villa are in for him. He's okay without being like... I don't know. What kind of contract does he want? He wants 90k a week, which I just don't think it's worth it. Charlie McNeil. He's not better than Jurassic, is he? And he'd have to play instead of Jurassic. No, like, nah. I guess he is English, which might be a nice thing to look at. I'm looking for players that are actually going to improve us. Oh, Robert Scov's on there. Robert Scov's on there, to be fair. He's on 65k a week. We can't afford that. But, I mean, is there any left backs or right backs, actually? Left backs and right backs are probably the two places that we do need players, definitely. I think I'll have to use my wild card today due to rotation risks and having Ericsson. We'll need to guess the round of 16 correct. You will, yeah. That's why I've used my... Um, I've used my limitless so it goes back again so then I can use my wild card ahead of the knockouts so that I can include the players that are in the knockouts. That's my thinking for today anyway. Um, Odrizola, 33. Probably no. Jordan Brown. Are you any good? N no. He's more of a 10 looking at his attributes. Yeah, probably. Which again, we've got like... I don't re we've got Gomez and if Gomez goes, I'd like to play Mario there. Honestly. So I don't really want to sign a, a, a 10. Matty target. Use limitless game week two. You get unlimited transfer before the round of 16 though. Um. Yeah, but you still... Yeah, oh, God, so I don't need to even use my wild card, so that's fine. I didn't realise that. That's cool though. Um, so I've still got my wild card later. Even better. How's Lalive for his promise going? Not well. Benjamin Henricks. Eh. None of these are like jumping out, are there? Are any of these have we got any like young players? He's a real he's a real boy. How do you use the limitless? I think it's just it's just click it on the app. I don't know what to say. <laughs> uh the limitless is just like a like a free hit in, in FPL. Trey Maria's a pressing forward, maybe. He's left footed actually. It kind of works that way. I think I'm going to revisit this. I don't really need to be doing this. We haven't really got any um, wages to use anyway. Yeah, when you go on transfers, it's up there somewhere. That's it. <laughs> All right. Uh, Wellington is on international duty. Is he at the... Is this, what's this? Why is Freddie Welly on international duty for like all of January? Um, why am I on this as well? Where's my? Where's that gone? There we go. Is he? Oh, he's at the African Nations, I think, isn't he? Yeah, he is. Um, all right, so that's even more reason we definitely need to play Sinchik at right back. Okay, um, that's still not enough money. Group of silly boy put an extra pair of socks on. Yeah, he's got blisters. So got no Gruber in the next game. Couple of big games then. Brighton, then Burnley. Games we should be winning. And if we do win them, puts us in a great position. They're six. If we can put another three points between us here, that would be lovely, wouldn't it? Good training from both Wingers and Mario. So let's praise them. Praise training. Praise training. Let's pat him on the shoulder as well. Has Freddie Welly signed a new contract? He has, yeah. So Freddie Welly signed a new contract at Ajax. Annoyingly, we didn't even realise. So we can't sign him on a free. He's also not been particularly good for us. Like, his average rating is 6.72. I mean, that's it's okay, but it's not great. I was expecting maybe a bit more from him. So I don't think we're going to sign him permanently now. Um, which is why we really, right back is a place we could be looking at. Not that we have any money. We'd need to sign sell someone, which... Was going to be Gomez, but he's rejected us. We're going to get Leo Mir, though. Leo Mir. He's 
an option in the future. I don't think he looks great, but everyone wanted him. So we're going to sign him on a free. 9k a week isn't too bad. He joins at the end of the season. <laughs> Hello, Cam. How you doing, buddy? I bought a guy from Angdalex for 34 million the next season. Newcastle bought him off me for 174. Spectre. Art of the deal. The art of the deal there. How much is it to buy him now? Oh, we haven't got... We could get him for 90k and get him now. Can I give myself 90k? No. That seems like... To have the to have an extra body, I don't. I guess I'd have to pay his wages as well, wouldn't I? He's not really good enough to bring in. There's no real point, is there? I might as well wait. Yeah, you're not, Ollie. You let me down a little bit there by not being on those top trainers. <laughs> uh, you're good. I'm glad you are, buddy. Welcome in. Hope hope things are all well. You've already said that. You can't afford 90k. I know. <laughs> We've got zero in our budget though. Literally zero. We put it all into wages, didn't we, to get pole in? All my good players getting injured. Can happen. Have a look at their, like, um, match load and everything. Maybe think about a bit of rotation. Because when that piles up, it, you're not doing anything different. But that can pile up sometimes and it can be an issue. Um, Gasparoni on the bench. Gaspy goal. I think so. Otherwise, the team, does it stay the same? I think it probably does. We were good in that last game. I think we keep things ticking over. And then our sub attacker is going to be Gasparoni. Predictions, everybody. We're playing Brighton away from home. If you'd like to do a prediction, you need to do a prediction right now. As I'm about to press go. Squad numbers. Why is it telling me about squad numbers now? Oh, it's not. 3 0. 3 1 2 2. It's the start of the season. Oh, that's annoying then. 2 7 1. I don't know what to say about that. Training? Maybe. I don't know. It's probably just unlucky, to be honest. All right, Lenny's asleep. That's good news. Right, we're going to submit the team. If you've not done any prediction yet, too late. Look at that. All greens. That's nice. That's nice, isn't it? All right. There are the two teams. They've got Joaquin Marler, our, uh, our guy, Joaquin Marler. They've also got Mario Tompkins, who is also one of our guys. He's brilliant. Um, pick up where you left off. Let's pump some fists right at them. Oh, that went green for a second. Then I ruined it. That's a shame. Valoranga just injured four of my players. Yikes. <laughs> wow. Uh, we're underway. Uh, there we go. Uh, solid first 10. Nil, nil. Brighton, one place below us in the league. After Tottenham are either currently winning or have won, they've gone back above us. We've got a corner early. Cuisance towards... Oh, my word. I think it's Barrios almost on the end of it there. Got Wackham on Fantasy now. Ball. Oh my word, what a goal! Christoph Lalivre! Get in, he smashed it in. We were there behind the goal to see it going in. Come on! 1 0, 18th minute. It's a, it's a kind of recycled from a corner this time. Headed away. Back out to Cuisance. Who gets the assist here? Was it Cuisance again? It was. Oh my word, what a hit. On the half volley as well. Go on, Christoph. He was one of the players that was linked to be under 21 player of the year, wasn't he? I think Jurassic won it in the end, didn't he, as well? So we've got some good youngsters in our team. Go on, Sinchek, nearly. Musaba. Windal clears. Are we picking this up? Gomez is going to get there first. He's got Jurassic with him. Could go alone. He does go alone. It's a good save from Mino Aravi. What a striker. Mickey C assist better than Gerard. Uh, is that... I feel... This is the year he's going to beat his record, right? And now they're going to leave. Bro. <laughs> I like it, babe. It's good. Jurassic did win it. Yeah, I thought so. Oh, God. Here's Minto. Minto's in. He's put it wide. Sunday did enough. I'm going to say Sunday did enough Bobby. there. Okay. Yeah, how many Mickey C assists has it been this year? I think 14 is the record for a season. And I think he was on like about 10 or 11 already. So he's got another one there. I don't know if he got one in the first game. He scored four goals. He probably did get one, didn't he? Oh, he's missed it at the back. Gomez is in for two. It has to be. It is. Paul with the assist this time. Gomez scores 2-0. I quite like Gomez as the other striker. We've obviously used him a lot deeper as like the number 10, but I quite like him as our sort of like second striker alongside Jurassic. He's good. He's good. This is a nice finish. It was quite an easy finish, but 2-0, half an hour on the clock. Brighton are apparently not very good, Spectre. Yeah, although they're doing quite well this year. We've definitely lost to them before because I remember Mario Tompkins scoring. 
Uh, did you buy Paul or loan him? Just uh, loaned him, EJ. He wasn't registered for Barcelona, so we could get him in on loan. We're just paying his wages. Um, hopefully, we can make it permanent in the in the summer, though. He's our type of player, isn't he? Cuisance. Cuisance, one assist. Oh, my word, he's almost scored. What an effort. Gomez has improved since we tried to offload him to China. That is, yeah, potentially true. <laughs> I see Michael Owen has got himself into some bother. Has he? What's he got himself into some bother about? I've not seen that. Oh, I thought that was going to be a pen. It's not. Brighton's still on the attack, though, but I thought Wyndell was giving away a penalty there. Mario Tompkins, Minto. Paul clears. Okay, he's cleared it off. Off Cuisance's head there. That was a little bit unorthodox. Oh. Cuisance tackles. Oh. What a weird highlight. <laughs> uh, Ski, welcome in, buddy. Hello. And also, thank you for the follow, dude. Appreciate you. Oh, did he? Good Lord. What an idiot. A uh, bit of punching in those DMs than he did on BT. Christ, I've not seen those. Gomez has scored again, though. 3-0. They do have Super Mario. I feel like maybe we should sign Super Mario just because he's one of those players. We need to sign, like, one of Ronaldo, Savio, Michael Jackson, Mario Tompkins. Do you know what I mean? Like, those players that we've noticed as we've been playing. Yamar is Yadar. All right. Thank, thank you, Ski. Welcome, welcome in. Um, <laughs> what a start. We're 3-0 up, though. I don't care. There are a couple of things surprised me. One, he has a wife. Two, someone finds him interesting. Yeah. Got to be Ronaldo. Ronaldo's great, EJ. I just feel like he's quite expensive. We'll see, though. Savio would be great as well, though. Um, Don't let your performance levels drop. Never forget when you tried to buy him when they asked for 20 million um, in League One. Yeah, that was quite a lot of money, wasn't it? Um... Sadio Mane is the best football player in the world. Ski, your um, your your first messages in this chat have been weird. Like, that's all I'm saying. Weird. Like I love Matt Sadio Mane, but no, no one mentioned him. Surely that goes in. What is going on? What is going on? <laughs> yeah, money helps. That's true. That's true. All right, three 0 with sixty on the clock. Let's do some more changes like we did last time. Um. I think the Liverpool guy he's talking about. That's yeah, no, I know what he's saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what he's doing. It's just it, it, there's not really any context to it, is there? Right, let's do Barrios for Belcher, and he's on a yellow. That can be the first sub. And I want to get um oh Jurassic's actually not playing very well. I want to get um Maria on as well. Cleared by Sincheck. Right mid swap. Yeah, I did right mid. Masab. Oh, that's going to be... Oh, my word. Sunday's keeping us in it. Uh, how's Wee Lenny today? He's all right. He's just asleep down here, actually. Do you want to see him? Have I got Clates come on this one? Um, He's just... He's just there, look. He's got... Like, you can't really see him there. He's just, just asleep down there, look. There he is. Upside down. He's got his little onesie on. We scored! Jurassic! Get that camera off there, chap. Get your emotes in. Da, 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 That's all right, Ski. Just, just didn't really understand da, da, it. That's all, mate. Da, da, <laughs> Come on. Ah! Four nil. Another assist for Cuisance. A big header from Jurassic. Did Paul head that as well? I'm not sure what actually happened there. Two assists from Cuisance, though. Actually sleeping in his bed and not next to it. Crazy. I know, right? I don't know what, what's up with him. He's not feeling well. He's actually in his bed. <laughs> Great timing, yeah. Um, Badrami down the right for Brighton. We can do a couple more subs now. We're 4-0 up. We've won our first game 4-0. We're 4-0 up in our second game. This is, this is good. That's a lovely cup, uh, cup mat you have. Thank you. What, this one? There's a few. I've got some good, good, good coasters. The coaster game's good. I've got this one, which is a nice little map one. And we've got an I has a beard one, which is this one. They've scored. Mario Tompkins. I said he'd score. He will always score. These are glorious. They're good, aren't they, Phil? Complete demolition job. Wolf, you say that as um as Brighton score. But yeah, it was until that, wasn't it? It was it was good until then. Rest in check, give the young lads some mins. Yeah, I like that. Let's do We need to get one of these. Really, we need to get all three of these off. Um Arojo, definitely. Cuisance and Lalivra. Are we leaving them on? Start doing an England save. Nice. I am gonna do that. I'm gonna do both subs now. What's the stadium looking like? Um, Ski, we're in the Hawthorns at the moment. We're stadium sharing because um, we've got a new stadium being built that is done in June this year. So we're about 
five or six months away from our new stadium, which is they're building a 15k capacity stadium where we're averaging about 25k at the Hawthorns at the moment. So not sure how that's going to go. Okay. But yeah, we are getting a new stadium very soon. Maybe watch your TikToks multiple times yesterday. What a man you are. Thank you, Philip. Appreciate you. <laughs> On that TikTok uh, grind. I need to do some more, actually. I like with TikToks. They're quite easy to kind of stack up. They've scored again, James Justin. Don't do this, Hereford. Is it June? It is June. I see what we've done there, Ollie. Um, I need to record some more and edit some more and get them ready. Uh, West Brom's Nerdiverse. We're at West Brom Stadium. So it's kind of sort of local to Hereford. We're hit, we've been here... Is it two seasons we spent here now? I think it is, right? Right, we've won the game. That puts us third in the league. 39 points. We are almost safe. Imagine like last year where we... <laughs> you can schedule them, by the way. Oh, can I actually schedule them? I didn't know that. I've got, I have them in drafts. So I, I like to like edit them and do them anyway. But yeah, I need to like um, stack them up and get them recorded. Last year, we were worried about relegation. We've almost reached the 40 point mark just over halfway now. This is nice. Make on phone, save the phone and upload on PC. Oh, can you schedule them on the PC? Can you? Nice. I see. Since it's Brighton, do another Brighton TikTok. I actually you do need to do that, yeah. Those are a bit longer because they have to actually edit them. <laughs> um, oh, Gomez with two goals. Go on, mate. Brighton's game in hand won't overtake you. No, we've won five in a row. Look at us. We are flying. We have beaten Everton, Southampton, Newcastle, Leicester, Brighton in the league. We've conceded two nearly every single game, but we're scoring four, three or four every game pretty much. We've also beaten Peterborough in the cup in that time. Did you know the Hawthorns is a one hour and 15 minute drive away from the Hereford Community Stadium? There you go. Facts being spoken by Ryan in, in the chat there. He's definitely not Googled it. Bournemouth going in hard. Um, where are Bournemouth in the league? Are they doing all right? Are they? 15th. Um, five in a row and Burnley next. You're so losing. I know, Ray. Uh, uh, Ollie, yeah. But what? I don't, in fact, can we look at our previous um, past meetings? We are so bad against Burnley. Look at our past five meetings. <laughs> We've won this zero out of five. We've drawn three and lost two against them. We lost four nil to them. What is going on about like Burnley are so good. we are so bad against them? Of course, we've won five in a row in the league. We are now playing Burnley. Are we playing away from home as well? It's but no Burnley at home with this as a record against them. You know what's happening, don't you? Just all I will say is. Bear that in mind when you're doing your predictions. Bear that in mind because five, <laughs> five meetings, zero wins. The managers are, um, I don't know why it's showing me. The, oh, between the managers, I see. Oh, he was Watford manager before. Who is it? Who is the Burnley manager? It's Ruby. It's unavoidable, I'm afraid. Yeah, logic decides you're losing the next game. It does, doesn't it? <laughs> we're actually we've got three days does this squad need resting tell you what the midfield definitely does i think the rest will probably be okay but these lads these midfield two were knackered at the end of that game so let's um let's give them a couple of days off ruby 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 they have chalov he's been really good in my save chalov's pretty good on fm generally isn't he yeah feather chalov all right i've rested a couple of them we've got no freddy welly Let's uh, let's see how we do against them. <laughs> um, oh, we've got a bid. Oh, it's Alamelli. They keep coming in for Alamelli, but like his value. When I spoke to him and said, I'll accept a reasonable bid for you. He expects a bit of 17 million. His value should be way higher than 1 million. We just, we talked about it last time. His rep's really low. Like you can loan him. What? They wanted to offer more so that we could buy him outright. Right, so Norwich will pay his wages. Do we loan out Alamele? I think we have to do something to get his rep up and to get his value up. He has no interest in joining. 
He's probably going to say no anyway, isn't he? Should I loan list him and then he, maybe he'll be interested in joining? There'll probably be other bids um, coming in for him anyway if I loan list him. So, like, I reckon we do. I don't know who we're going to sign as a backup left back. We're going to have to loan a left back, but there wasn't really anyone, was there? But I feel like we kind of have to do something. Um... Can I set... Who's... Oh, these guys aren't doing anything anymore. Oh, these are new. I haven't set my new scouts yet, have I? So let's get... Um... You finished yours. You were supposed to find a wing back. Who did you find? Well, this guy's apparently good. Yeah, he is good, but he's a bit expensive. You're on transfer interested. Uh, yeah, I was. That's true. I, w I wasn't really looking at those, though, because we've already looked for quite a long time. Um, any of these cheap? You're relatively cheap. You're not that good, though. Um, so yeah, I've already asked a, a scout to go and look for left backs, and these are the left backs he found. It's only a backup, that's the thing. Peru guy had eight crossing. Yeah, I think he is. He's just wan -Bissaka. All right, so who do I need to... Brendan McFarlane. In fact, no, let's do Ricardo Correa. Go and find me a left back that I can loan from anywhere that is for a... Mm, that is a backup player that fits the 4-4-2. There's a left back. You need to do that in... You've got one month, so that'll be the end of the window. Hello, Sam. Welcome in, buddy. How are you? From the scouting pool. Um, no, not from the scouting pool. Ricardo Correa. If you find me a lovely Brazilian that wants to come on loan, perfect. I feel like that's slightly... I'm not sure he will find that, but let's see if he does. And then I think we accept the Alamele thing, and then we just go from there. I mean, with it, it's a risk to let him go, but Alamele has played... How many games this year? One game in the league. Like, letting him go out on loan, I feel like is probably okay. Worst case scenario, we don't sign anybody. Yoon can play left back. Like, not very well, but he could play there. He's, like, fairly natural there, right? Like, look, Yoon could play as a left back. That's a six foot five left back, but you know what I mean. <laughs> it's not going to be very good, but he could do it. All right, Mendoncha's gone there. Oh, look, it says to play Alamele. I'm not going to. Oh, Vidmar's back. Vidmar plays for Burn uh, Burnley, doesn't he? Right, here we go with Burnley. If you want to start doing your predictions, start getting them in now. You know our record against Burnley. It's not good. Get your predictions in. Let's see how we can... Um, let's see how we do against them. 3-1 loss 5-1 Hereford 2-2 1-1 two, two, one, one. A lot of people going for draws Rostislav They've gone for a 2-2 3-3 two, two. Three, three for Andrew Loads of draws 1-0 Burnley That'll definitely be a Vidmar header as well Vinska Definitely <laughs> mm. I like that Ollie. 3-2 to break the duck I like it Oh I've missed the follow there Diogo Thank you for the follow dude Welcome in uh, Jao says 1-1. One, 3-1 one. One says 2 7 one, one. I hope so. Oh, we got bids. That is not a loan bid, mate. I've said he's available for loan. A Rojo. Ooh. Uh, Dorman a bid for a Rojo. Hey, go stage. Serious. Ghostage, thank you for the prime, buddy. Welcome in, dude. Thank you very much. Chat, can we go wild? I love a brand new sub. That is always like, oh, get in. Welcome in, Ghostage. Hope you're good, my friend. If you get in the Discord, if you're not in there already, there's a subsection that we don't use enough, but we're going to try to. What do I do about this bid? That is a... Does he have a release clause? 95 million. Hello, Dan. 
I'll commit 95 or nothing. I think you're correct. I'm going to reject. Was he interested? We might need to speak to him if he was interested. Yeah, the crabs now move. The scary crabs that move. Yeah. There's also other animated ones. Jurassic, when he scores a goal, that's animated. Uh, get in the subsection, you also get a sub sound. Mm, you do. You don't get to play it, but you do, yeah. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Look at everyone saying hi to Dan. It's nice here, isn't it? Look at him. Coming in with his with his mod sword, just saying hi to people. A big name on campus. What a guy. All right, let's do this team for Burnley. Our bogey Burnley team. Who's he wanted by? Everton. Sunday's also wanted by Valencia. Arojo Dortmund. Hang on a minute. I've only just signed you. What do you mean you're wanted? Loans. Okay. Altran's wanted on loan as well. Um, two mimosas down. You love to see it. Daniel Mimosas. Um, need an animated Lenny. How can we animate Lenny though? Not sure. You send whatever sound you want to collect and he decides if he wants to use it. He doesn't. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> What's the occasion, DG Media? Right. Let's pick this team. I think we're going to go same team. I don't see a reason to change it. We've won our last two games comprehensively. The team is in. And... Um, we're going to go and try try and beat Burnley, who every single time we play them, we fail to beat. So here we go. Oh, yeah, it's Father's Day today. That's true. Forgot about that. Um, pick up where you left off. That's fine. Have faith in you. So much faith, lads. Very, very full of faith. Yeah, it's his nan's birthday. It's, it's Father's Day, and he's here watching, watching me play football manager. Imagine. He's here briefly. Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> uh, ball forward then. Burnley on the attack. Inside the first minute. We all know how this ends up, don't we? With, with us nicking the ball and launching an attack with Barrios. To Jurassic. Here we go. I'm on the wrong scene. Jurassic's about to score the open. No, he's not. Pep Gomez. Lalivre saved. Oh, it was close. Did you get anything from Lenny for Father's Day? No. No, just a very early morning wake up call. That was all. So, I mean, maybe he's counting that as his present. <laughs> All right, we've nearly scored early against Burnley. That was a good start. We look okay. I didn't actually encourage. Let's do that now. Look at us. Look at us. Who would have thought it? Third in the league. Cuisance corner. Pole. Oh, Pole's not scored yet, has he? He's at that near post. All six foot six of him. Good wind down. Boots it forward. Calvin. Is actually his name there. Uh, my whole family in the house are watching you. Maybe alone. Right, I got you. Okay, that was a really weird thing to think about before you said that you were at home alone. Because, yeah. <laughs> Vidmar's on the bench. He is, yeah. Poor Vidmar. They bought him for, what, 40 million? They've stuck him on the bench. He probably would have been on the bench for us as well, to be fair. Because we brought Pole in. So, maybe maybe not so bad. Uh, Barrios down the right-hand side. Lovely run from him. Finds Cuisance. Into La Livre. Oh, my word. What a goal. Another assist for Cuisance. Mickey C with another assist. Into La Livre, who smashes home. This is a beauty of a goal, by the way. Barrios with, has that ball carrier down the right-hand side. Clipped ball into Cuisance. Cuisance, look. You thought he was going to hit it. No. Reverse ball. La Livre into the corner. 1-0. Oh, so we might be good. At the moment, at the moment, we're very good. We are playing Burnley, though. So I'm not getting ahead of myself in this game. We looked at the last five meetings between us and Burnley. Um, Dan, you weren't there for, for that part. Dan, how many wins do you think you've got? In our, do, do you think we've got in our last five meetings against Burnley? We played Burnley the last the past five times. Zero is correct. Yeah, we've we've drawn three and lost two against them. So I'm not getting ahead of myself. Cuisance, big tackle, go on. New emotes, what a big time streamer. I told you, new emotes are in. We've got new emotes. Gomez, 2-0. Come on. We're winning 2-0. Mixie being a second option to JWP despite being better is incredible. I know, right? Mixie's great, isn't he? He's so good. I, I think he was involved there. He won the ball back there before we moved it on. So glad you missed out on him. Yeah, so it's really true. Um, yeah, we've got new emotes because I moved some emotes into the animated emotes um, slots. We've now got a, new, a few new emotes. We've got a crab raid emote. 
So when we raid at the end of a stream, I'd like that to... I want the crabs dancing and the crab raids in between. I want us all to set up to do a really impressive raid like that, okay? There's also a Megson emote. And there's also a, a Mike Bassett emote. Things that I've had ready just didn't upload because we didn't have a slot. So, you know, that's it. Leone gets it. That's what I want. I want our crab, our raid to look like that. So if you want to copy and paste that, it's very early. But basically, it needs to look like that. And it's going to look great. All right, we're going to be the best raiders on Twitch. <laughs> Don't want to be ahead of myself, but we might beat Burnley. Not Fla. You've, I've seen us throw away worse, worse leads than this. Megs will be prevalent soon, maybe. Jurassic. Oh, it should have been three. Should have been three. You reckon it's going to be 3-2, do you reckon, Ollie? I'll copy that because I'll accidentally do a Lenny if I don't. Yeah. I should make it a um a chat command as well, actually. Because then I can then you can copy and paste it from me. It'll be easier. I'm sure the mods are going to be on it. The mods are always on it. How's Kat? Yeah, she's all right. She's um tired. Good save, Sunday. We've had a bit of a hectic week this week. Like, she's been like slammed at work. And I've been really busy at work. There's lots going on. It's like end of year stuff. So it's like pretty intense. And then Lenny's had his surgery on Wednesday. And he's got to wear this onesie thing. But he hates the onesie thing. So he takes it off. So then he can get to his stitches. And then that's never a good thing. And he can't go for a walk properly. Because, um... Oh... Uh, Nightbot needs a sub. Um, so he's like all got all of this pent up energy, which we're not allowed to let him do because it can he can, you know, open up his stitches. So yeah, it's a bit stressful that end. And then there's all sorts of other things going on. So we're good, but like I'll tell you then, things are going well. Um tired is the word. Hence why no stream yesterday, just because it was just like the flat was an absolute state. We just needed to do stuff. Oh, you can still copy and paste it, that's true. You get it free, though. What do we get free? Well, I don't know what you mean. Um, well, Nightbot. Yeah, I do, actually. I need to... I did ask, actually. You're true. That's true, Phil. I asked to, for them to mod Nightbot, and they never got back to me, actually, Twitch. I need to send another one. You send an email to ask for it, and then they're supposed to do it, but they never did. I will uh, have to do that again. Um, 60 minutes in. We're playing very well. 2-0 up. We've got two tired midfielders, so I'm going to take... I'm going to do both, I think, in one foul swoop, like that. Yeah, they do, Phil, yeah. They just didn't do it for me yet. I need to do it. Um, And it should be Nightbot rather than Stream Elements. Maybe they gave it to Stream Elements. Maybe that was it. It wouldn't be the end of the world, but yeah. So Cat pays for subs. <laughs> yeah, of course. Of course. <laughs> Jurassic for three. He scores. Chat, get that animated emote in the chat. Jurassic makes it 3-0. We might... We just might be beating Burnley here. Everybody. <laughs> Come on. They have, you know. No, I think that might have been gifted one before, Phil. Oh, it's T3'd. Oh, maybe. Yeah, they have then. That's what they've done. It's fine. It doesn't matter. We can just set the emo the um, the commands up on there. Um, Come on. 3-0 up. That makes sense, though. To be fair, I should use Stream Elements more than I use Nightbot anyway. Don't really need both, but there you go. Come on, 3-0 up. Jurassic with a goal as well. We've got another sub left to do. So let's do one of these very tired players with 10 minutes to go. We have been brilliant today. Very quietly, we've been excellent. Um, defenders can stay on. Barrios, Beltran. Let's do that. What did Leone do? Shouted you out. I see. Nice. Nice. I like it. Hey, Phil. Thanks for gifting a sub. Gifting a sub over to Sancho. Thank you, buddy. Fixed. Oh, yeah. There you go. You can set up the command on stream elements. Love it. Well done. Yeah, maybe we should start doing that. Maybe we should try and phase out Nightbot a little bit. Nightbot's really easy to edit stuff on, though. I quite like it. We'll see. Uh, thank you, Phil, for gifting a sub over to Sancho, though, dude. Appreciate you. That is your 182nd gifted sub chat can we show some love for that i'm sure you already have but thank you oh phil's gifted us up to nightbot now as well 183 thank you buddy chat can we just do loads of emotes let's just do loads of crabs there we go thank you we're winning games we've got gifted subs going on do you reckon a gifted sub emote's a good one jurassic's missed that do you reckon a gifted sub emote's a good one that might be a shout like then you can specifically do it when people gift subs I've seen other streamers do that. That's a good shout. Maybe we'll do that. And then Leone can basically get that every stream. And Phil can get it basically every stream. 
Uh, Phil is flashing his wallet. He is. He is. I always think of a submarine for like gifted subs. Oh yeah, we could do something like that. I don't know. Have a think. Let me know what you want from emotes. So they, I feel like we can switch them up a little bit now. I'm going to change the um, the uh, the lime cordial bottle emote to a, uh, a sparkling water. I feel it's more prevalent these days to do the sparkling water. So I will, I'm going to change that one. Uh, that's my next job. But if there's any other ideas, let me know. A present box with a crab poking out. Yeah, something like that. Jurassic. He's done it again. He's done it again. You know what I'm out to use right now, don't you? He's done another goal. How many has he got for the season now? We are, we're breaking our Burnley hoodoo. We haven't won in five games against them. We're winning this one though, and we are winning it comprehensively. Jurassic's on a hat trick. He's got a couple of minutes to get it. He's not going to get it. We're going to win 4 0. Come on. Less than Esposito, probably. Um, yeah, he, almost certainly. That puts us third in the league. If they win, I mean, even if they win their games in hand. We're going to be at least fourth here. We are in the top four legitimately with 23 games played. This is excellent stuff. I'm very happy. Since when do we score four goals in a game? Since every game this stream done. Esposito scored again, did he? Christ's sake. Um, I think we've played three games this stream, right? And we've won them all by scoring four goals. I'm fairly sure. Yes. Look. 4-0, 4-2, 4-0 in our three games today. We've also won now, I think it's six in a row in the league. Wowzers. I've just said the word wowzers there. And I meant it. Um, Jurassic's got 19 goals in 23. And he's not the top goal scorer in the league. Because Esposito's got 26 in 23. He's a joke. Oh, Cuisance is on 13. He's one away from the, uh, from the record for his assists. Arojo's got 10, by the way. More goals than Pipers. Yeah, Jurassic is outscoring Pipers with 19. What a player he is for us, by the way. What a player. Yeah, that is big, right? 10, 10 assists from him on the left mid is really good. Um, I've got 200k to do big things easy, right? Uh, yeah, you'll be fine. You, you'll find players. You'll, you'll be fine. Um, what a performance. What two seasons from him. He should, if he doesn't pick up an injury, which he did last year, remember... He should be able to break his goal scoring record from last year as well, which is very, it bodes very well. Piper's actually, to be fair, we really wanted him. He's had a good first season, hasn't he? Europe's looking likely up the Hereford. At the moment it is, unless we go on one of our mental losing streaks like we did last year. I mean, look at this. Like last year we did this. Like you, we don't get Europe if we do that again. Hereford, when a team who has been in a great position all season goes on to bottle at the climax of a campaign. See, also bottling. Yeah, exactly. If, unless we do a Hereford, we'll be fine. Oh, we got a million pounds. He's played 20 games for Sunderland. Does that actually go into our... There we go. 262 into our wage... Into our transfer budget. We could sign... Um, We could sign our guy now, our centre-back. I don't think we need to, but we could. We've got our 90k to spend. What's our money like? Still in debt. Slightly less debt, though. That's good. With the current form, I can't imagine there being a bad streak like that. You'd imagine there wouldn't be, but... It isn't called doing a Hereford for nothing. Oh, Barrios with a 10 in training as well. Right, Lalivra suspended is a blow. I guess Aziz comes in for him, right? I'm almost tempted to do that. I'm almost tempted to bring Gomez into the midfield and do... Gruber up front. Because he's been good, Gruber, and he should be back. I might do that. We'll see when we're closer to the time. 90k in the bank. Rich, I know, right? <laughs> Get down the casino. Put that one mil all on red. You double your money. I believe that's how it works. Yeah. It's either you double your money or you lose all of your money, right? So what's there to lose except for all of your money? Ooh, FA Cup fifth round draw. Oh, we find out if we're playing Leeds or... Was it Gillingham or something? It's Leeds. It is definitely Leeds. Oh, yeah. I mean, Ollie said it before, didn't he? It is Leeds. We could offer John Terry the under-23 manager's job. Actually, yeah, you can go on that coaching. That was weird. Who's winning today, today Wales or Italy chat? I'm going to go uh, Italy. They've rejected that. Why would you? 
Okay. No worries. Oh, God. We've given Gomez 350k. There goes our money. <laughs> Football is always the winner, yeah. Spurs next, easy game. Spurs away, they're fourth, we are third. This is a big game, to be fair. Um, Italy with a bail goal would be lovely. So for fantasy reasons, but also, yeah, I see what you've I see what you've done there. I reckon Bale will get a hole in one today. Maybe. Maybe. How bad was Bale's penalty, by the way? He looks so nervous uh, as he steps up for that. It felt really obvious that he was going to miss. Defo beating Spurs. I hope so. We've been in a hell of a run of form. Any squash left? I haven't actually started the squash. I've still got cold coffee to drink. All right. I didn't think it was going to be that cold. That was ridiculously cold. Ooh. Um, okay. They've signed Yildirim. Oh, I like this player. Chelsea have signed over how much? 44 mil. Okay. Um, have you received your invitation to be Spurs manager yet? Uh, they're con contacting everyone. Not yet. I am waiting though. It surely won't be long. It was big brain from Bale. Can't play well enough to convince Madrid to give him a new contract. I see what he's done there. Yeah. Where's the uh, the ember? Yeah, good question. It's um, it's in the kitchen. Don't know why I didn't go for it. I like to mix it up with my mugs. You know, I wanted to use this one today. Got lots of mugs and I want to use them. So I should have used the ember really. The ember's great if we do an extra long stream, which you know, if we do like a twelve hour or something, the ember's perfect then. Got the Liverpool mug exactly, Phil. Right. Reminded me of, of of times when, you know, when my team was good. Not like England these days. Can you just leave me alone, please, Benny? Like, you're obviously not going to play. And I obviously I'm not going to let you leave because you're a hero here. Actually, has that changed? Do we have any, like, um, new, like, legends or anything? Ooh, that, is that new? Jurassic's on the favoured personnel. I feel like that's new. We're going to a big game. Yeah, definitely. What's your personality like? I need to check that, actually. You need an ember mug when the weather is already hot. Less, no, le it's less needed, right? Yeah. Uh, what logo pack? I don't know, Liam. It's a great question. Just one of the generic ones that you see, first of all. Nothing special. I actually need to change this as well, don't I? Is that open? Um, I don't actually know what it is, though, so sorry. <laughs> Let me change this. We are not anywhere near 200. So let me change the sub goal. There you go. Um, it's, yeah. So just Google logo pack and it'll be one of the first ones, Liam. I'm sorry. I can't give you a better answer. I should probably find out to let people know. I did it like four years ago. And it's just the same one from there. Yeah. Jurassic's on favor personnel. We've got no other players that have made it to icons or legends. We are a legend at the club. No other players look, which is interesting. I thought they might have been moved on maybe till now, but no. I've declined to speak to Benny Ashley Seal there. He's now, he's now out with flu. So after I refused to speak to him, I've got... I'm, I'm lucky. It's lucky that I did then, isn't it? What logos did you do in 2015, please? Yeah, exactly, Pav. I don't know. Ooh, Sunday's bruised his knee, but he's going to be back. It's all good. Like, with logos, you just move them across from year to year. So I don't know what I downloaded when I was 15. Probably not at 15. That was an exaggeration. I can tell you which uh, which which photo pack, though. And um, player... What's it called? Face pack I'm using. Good training from you. 10 out of 10. Let's praise your training as well. It's always nice to do a bit of praising, especially when things are good. Praise your training. He made Benny ill by rejecting to talk to him. Yeah, or he would have made me ill and I avoided it. Maybe put it on the go XLR. Yeah, maybe actually. It might be easier. <laughs> what logo pack are you using? I don't know. <laughs> That's bullying, that is. It's not bullying. No, 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 no. Not having that. No chance. Oh, we've just done a nice bit of uh, Ninja Warrior training there. That's always good. Always fun. Glad that we did that. Um, not much going on. Just waiting for this Spurs game. Play the Megson clip. Oh, we could do that. Is that still on here? Yeah, it's good to do the hour. 
Ainsley Matalan Neal. No, you. I don't know where it's what gone. What a save! Angus Gunn. Oh, he's still on there. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. What do you reckon, Gary? What logo pack am I using? I don't know. There you go. Uh, Benny is Danny Rose on the Spurs dock. He's going to the chairman about you. Yeah, but Benny doesn't really want to leave. He just wants. He just knows he's not good enough. Just know, like, really, he doesn't want to leave. Basically, if he makes an appearance for us, Benny Ashley Seal, he gets 48k for an appearance. Like, he's loving it here. Surely he doesn't want to leave. Milan's still interested. No, they're definitely not, Benny. Look, in fact, I'll tell you, is anybody interested? No, they're not. Because you really can't play football. He has got five caps for England, though, and scored twice. So, so bless him. Fair play to him. Insightful as ever, ever Gary, yeah. I don't know. Does anyone want a new series scene that involves Gary Megson? Does, is that... Would anyone be into that? Gary, would you fancy it? I don't know. Yeah. A loan bid for Godinez. I think we keep him around. What's going on with this Alamele bid? Is he going or not? What's the youth intake? Oh, actually, did we get the preview? Oh, yeah, we did get the preview and it's not great, right? Uh, How do I do it here? Um, don't expect much is the final word on there. It's not a great one. Toxic from Ollie. Love that. Um, yeah, we've got lots of, we've got one good defensive midfielder and one good, def yeah, we've got one good defensive midfielder who's French. Not Ollie French. He's just French. Yeah. Probably hold on to your channel points. I don't know why we're not getting good ones. We've improved our facilities so much. Look. Youth facilities improved. Youth level is currently being improved again. Training facilities going up. Youth level's been done like, like loads of times. We're actually pretty good. We just don't produce good players. J Mob's French, yeah. Hey bro, I'm French. Loads of like Ollie French Junior Junior. There's so many Ollie Frenches in this game. Loads of Dan Dan Garvins as well. Everywhere they are. There'll be another Tobias Larone soon. Tobias Larone Junior. Right. Are we? Are we allowing Alamele to go out on loan? We are losing our left back cover and we don't really have left back cover. But I'm thinking if he plays games, he'll actually get a bit of his value back. Who's the head of youth development? That's actually a good, good thing to check. Um, look, he, was quite, he used to be quite good. What am I, Where do I put it? He's on here, isn't he? Oh, Henry. Mm. Oh, it's Phil Jagielka. He's a model citizen as well, which is why I had him doing it. He's not bad. He's not terrible. Can you get more left back cover on loan? That's kind of what we were looking to do, Hen um, Dave. Your assist manager is the one in charge of the youth intake since he's the one who shows up in the youth intake screen. Um... Yeah, but working with youngsters, I don't think that affects it. Your assistant... Yeah, I think it's more assistant manager, yeah. You can do left if needed and can't Welly. Can we, oh, yeah, Welly. Can he do left back as well? No. Not really. Sincheck, can he do left back? Where is he? No. Yeah, it's just Yoon, really. Probs re replaced just because, yeah... I, I guess if we're not getting good ones, we probably need to change. And Paul, Yeah, Paul can Paul do left back. Yeah, he can actually, can't he? Not very well, but yeah, he can. We've got options there. They're just not very good options. If there was a better one to loan, I'd like to loan one in. There's just not really anybody. Should we ask the, um, the DOF? Any loan left backs available? No. Who would you sign? Thiago Lopez. He's actually wanted by some good teams. Like 10 mil. There'd be a loan on the transfer list. That we've looked and there just weren't it, there wasn't any good left backs on the transfer list. We'll try again. Badia Shile might be able to cover that. I'm just not really into the um the, the centre backs being there. They just don't have like the the the, the crossing and the dribbling. I love Brazilian left backs. Yeah, me too. They are good. Who's this guy? Is he the only? Okay, I've gone up to twenty five. Who's this Chinese guy? 
If you want the head of youth development to bring in the youth, I think you need to set that in the responsibility screen. Yeah, probably. Our assistant manager is good though, so it shouldn't be really an issue. Mittelstein, I like him. Not very good. So we could just loan him till the end of the season though. Yeah, these are just rubbish, but they are going to be backups. They are crap though. <laughs> they are they are quite bad. Um, no UK ones. No, nah, we looked at both. There's a guy at. Yeah, look. Callum Conway. Oh, actually, he's. N I don't think he was on there before. Maybe him. He wasn't on there before. We could loan him as a. He's leaving on a free. As cover, he'll do, right? Yeah, he'll do, yeah. Um, ooh, look at a natural left wing back so he could do left back. Yeah, Ollie, that's not a bad show. I reckon we try for him. They want a lot of money for him. I'm not paying that. Nah, nah, I'm not paying 13 quid. I don't think they're going to accept it, are they? I don't think we can get him. Without paying, like, what does that actually equal? That's like 1.5 million. We don't have it. Can I pay like, no. Oh, is Dave's regen in the game? Yeah, he's quite good. I think he played for Doncaster. He was good when we were playing against Doncaster. He's usually a left back, yeah. Um, I don't think we can do this, can we? Flipping heck, lads. Hey, Calm down. Hey, Philip, thanks for the 900. Just fixing a number. What does that take you to? Thank you, dude. Appreciate you. Chat, can we get some love? 900 bits. That's quite very, very kind. Ask the board. What, for the money? Nah, we haven't got any money, so they're going to say no. Who's look for a ball-winning uh, midfielder to retrain at fullback if I can't find any good natural ones? Maybe that's not a bad idea. I mean, have we got anybody that we can just retrain as a left wing, a left back, like left back here? Like the likes of um, who's left-footed? I was gonna say Maria, but we kind of need him. Not really. We haven't really got anyone, have we? We haven't got a big enough squad to start retraining. Mo Salah, square pegs, no point. Yeah, Arojo would be good there, but I think he's too good going forward to do that. Let me just put left wing backs on as well, just to see. Wait for these to load. I don't know why it takes so long here with these guys in the wrong order. Cameron, John. I don't know how bad that injury is. 12 days. Dan Garvin Jr. That's a, that's that's true. I think the rest here are quite bad. It's like these two. Like, he'd be perfect. Oh, actually, we weren't on doubtful. There might be a few more. Take Click transfer interest. Yeah, yeah, I will do. This guy comes up now as well, but... I mean, great physicals on Archie Brown. Brilliant physicals. The rest is a bit meh. He's definitely a winger. I don't mind him. He's just not quite okay. there. Okay. Um, thank you, Weekend Fawn. Thank you very much for the follow, dude. Welcome in. Bakayo Sacco. Sacco, Sacco. Oh, there's Dave Azapardi. He's at Birmingham now. Dave's not terrible. He's right footed though at left back, which I don't really want to use him. But yeah, European wing backs. Yeah, we'll go back to that end. What about Saka on loan? Covers all of the left wing then. They don't want to loan him. David Birmingham, things you love to see. That's actually hilarious. That's true, actually. <laughs> Where's Ollie Kemp? I don't know, actually. Not just British. Yeah, we'll look at the others after. Cold or silver. Yeah, the rest are rubbish here, aren't they? Um, let's just look at work permit ones. Maximiliano Woba. Is just, again, he's really a centre-back, isn't he? But he's quite good. He's definitely a centre-back. Yeah, I've seen he, he got the follow from Fabrizio. Why did that happen? Is it because he tweeted him saying fab? How much would you want for him? He's on 100k a week, so probably 
Yeah, they won't loan him because he's only transfer listed. Just put a football shirt you might be interested in. Oh, you put a football shirt that you might be. In, I might be interested in. Nice. I'll have a look in a bit. Um, you deserve a Fabrizio follow. I'm not sure Fabrizio is that into his football manager memes. What about this guy, Jaden? Uh. Talking Wolves, yeah, no, I know. Yeah, Talking Wolves is great. Well, he's a good left back, surprisingly. Yeah, he is. I don't think we can get him, though. Oh, this is frustrating. They're just not quite there, are they? That guy is the one. Callum Conway is the one, I think. Unless there was... Do you know what? Unless there was, instead of loans... Let's look for like a 19-year-old Colombian that we can get and try and structure a deal with his, not with his 200k. That's like the other thing that we could do. Very similar to Godinez at right back. Is there a very cheap Colombian guy? Like, you're French. You're 17 and French. Meh. Yeah. Um... Fabrizio does play at FF. He does, actually, yeah. Offer Saka whole wages. They wouldn't talk to me about... Um... Well, yeah, maybe I could. But what, what wages was he on? I could go back to that, I suppose. I didn't actually try, did I? Let's just try... Um... I just want to see if I can spot any good youngsters here. Wing back. Support. On deadline day, you get cheaper loans. That's also true. But we probably do need to bring somebody in, don't we? Zach was like 45k a week. It's not too bad. What about like Mario Chan? Because he, we'd probably be able to buy Mario Chan. He's pretty good, except for going forward. But we could probably buy him. Oh, they want a high fee. You've got two delays, two not... Yeah, we've got some delays. Delay Alamele till deadline day. That's true. We could do that. That's true. If any of these were wanted, I'd be straight in. Sandoval. Let me just see. If I do that, is there any, like, Colombian that come up that are wanted by other teams? Saka's the loan, if you can afford. Yeah. No. Did I put left wing back on? All right, let's try Saka. Oh, God. What did I even put in? Uh, the Barca B lads. I don't think it was that good. Those, um, he only came up on those filters when I put it down to quite bad. So I don't, he's probably not going to be that good. All right, let's just go with that and see. I don't think it's that important anyway. Alamele's played one game. If we could get someone, it'd be nice. If we can't, it's not the end of the world. All right, it's already gone. So I didn't delay it. I've already done it. So that's a shame. Any free transfers? Yeah, maybe worth a look, actually. Saka, I've made a bid for. Are there any, any freebies? Let's just ask, first of all, the... No. End of contract ones? No. But left wing backs. He loves this guy. Apparently not. 64 year old Roberto Carlos. You love a 37 year old Andy Robertson. Yeah. 39. We'll go to 39. I won't go any further than that. <laughs> really quick. Any expired? Sa Kang Sangwoo as 35 year old South Korea. Right, I'm just not going to look. Did you have Robertson at Malvern? Did we have Robertson at Malvern? That rings a bell. Did we actually have him? I feel like we did. You could ask the loan with option to buy for those who are transfer listed. Generally, clubs accept it. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, we did. I'm not sure I'd want to actually commit to buying their roster, Slav. You're probably correct, but yeah, I don't know. FA Cup, fifth round draw. Arsenal will play Fleetwood or Norwich. Hereford or Leeds will play 
Sheffield Wednesday. That concludes the FA Cup fifth round draw. Thank you for watching. Yeah, with the option. Yeah, option. Uh, true, true, true. You're right. Um, Pepe Gomez is going back to Spurs in this next game. Creative Cuisance on verge of team and Premier Division assists landmark. What is... Cuisance... What, th there should be a space there. My marking has just come into play. What about Zucchini on pizza? That's all right. Don't mind it. Uh, need to win the FA Cup. Yeah, I think Judy Chalmers needs sacking off. Her lack of effort is poor. Yeah, it is bad. Um, Premier Division record is 15 assists. And Cuisance is on 14. On 13. Is he on, what's he on? He's on 13. Come on, he can do this. He should do this. Arojo should be able to do it as well, to be honest. Um, Enigma, thank you for the follow. Before that, Dudley, thank you for the follow. Welcome both to the channel. Appreciate you guys. Predictions, get them in. Um, I'm not going to go to that meeting because I hate them. Williams, Cuisance and Jurassic in the team of the week. Beautiful. Dudley, thank you, buddy. I just said thank you for the follow. Now he subscribes with his prime chat. Get some love in there. Thank you, dude. Appreciate you. Welcome to... Uh, welcome. Oh, no, that's bad. I was going to say, welcome to uh, Team Clates. Look what you've done. No, it wasn't your fault. I'm not blaming you. Jurassic is out for two to three weeks. Uh, that means Gomez is back up front. That means Aziz starts. Ugh. Thank you, though, dude. I appreciate it, man. Could the board fire you if you don't do the recruitment meetings? Nah. Nah, the board aren't going to fire me, mate. Untouchable. Nah, I, nah, I don't think generally, I don't think they do that, no. They've rejected it. Should I try the optional? What do you reckon they're... Op What's he transfer listed for? 30 million. Should I say optional 40? See if they accept it. Gatsby up top. Um, yeah, Gruber would already be coming in anyway, I think. Um, for... Because I was going to put um, Gomez in midfield. So... Gruber and Gomez, I think, are my two. Unless we do Gaspi, but I think Gaspi probably on the bench. Do dinosaurs have knee ligaments? Uh, yeah, they do, yeah. I said it unless he gets an injury. Now he's got an injury for three weeks. I hope that isn't too disruptive. We've lost our best player there, haven't we? On this run of, what, five, six wins in a row? We now play a really tough team and we... Oh, Ian Robin has just been made the Everton manager. That's a horrible offer. Why would I accept that? I could have asked for... A... I could have got 95 million out of them then. But they've made it non-negotiable. Liam! Yeah. Thank you very much for the eight months, Liam. Chat, you know what to do. Welcome in, buddy. Hope you're good. Hope you're well. Thank you very much for the resub. You put us, is it three subs away from the, the goal? Beautiful. Thank you for all the subs today. I've had a few gifted, quite a few resubs, and a couple of uh, new subs as well. I appreciate that. All right, let's select this team then. What are we doing with no Jurassic? I think we do that, and I think we probably do that, and we probably do that. And then... It isn't great. Is it Gomez is injured as well? We haven't got a lot of midfield options here. I'm excellent. I hope you're well. Thank you. I'm good. You left for 20 minutes and didn't miss a game. No, you didn't. Uh, you won the Serie A. This says Fana. Um, third and fourth season. Won the Europa League. Um, won the European Super Cup. I still can't get an international job. What else do I have to win in order to get it? Uh, you should get it, Fana. Um, just wait till after like a major tournament. Is there like a major tournament coming up? Because after a World Cup like eight teams will sack their managers and you'll get offered them like you won't even need to do anything they'll offer you a job if you're decent because like spain italy germany basically if they don't win the world cup or the euros they'll sack their manager and you'll be able to get one okay we are a bit lacking in terms of backups here we're a bit short salah's made the bench again Sinchek's gonna play right back um Mm, we've lost quite a lot of impetus in our attacks there. 
I hope it doesn't cost us. That's the team. We play Tottenham at home. Away, sorry. Here we go. Oh, really, Fana? That's interesting. Did you start with quite a low reputation with quite a low... Um, have you got your coaching badges? That type of thing is probably the th only thing that would hold you back. Uh, what? The recent form standings. We're first. Love that. Harry Kane still at Spurs is surprising. He scored against us. I'm pretty sure last time we played them. Still, still there. Still starting at 35. They've got a corner. Oh, it's headed over by Cano. But yeah, no, Fano, I'm a bit surprised by that. I'd imagine they would have... At least one of them would have offered you. Don't forget Kane being dropped for Benny for England. That is true. That did happen. <laughs> Funny stuff. He did score though, didn't he? He repaid my faith in him, didn't he, Benny? So, Oyatabal. Martins, that's 1-0. Oh, we're losing. If there's any way to disrupt like a big, lovely run of form, it's injuries, isn't it? Injuries right before a really tough game as well. This is poor from Aziz in the midfield. There's an injury. Luck a player coming in for a suspension as well. Oyatabal, lovely through ball means that he can't miss this. Sunday's in no man's land. And Reese Martins, Ricardo Martins. We could equalize here though. We've got an attack headed away. Doc Martins or him, yeah. That's weird. Oh, okay, maybe maybe it's less um real rude. Maybe not then. I've had loads of offers on this save. Aziz. Barrios. Gomez has to be against his old team. It's 1-1. Come on. Good assist from Barrios. Good finish from Gomez. We're back level. Beautiful. Off to a flyer is a weird thing to say, considering it's 1-1, but okay. Pepe Gomez is a machine of a man. He's been excellent, actually. Since we tried to flog him to China, he's been excellent. He rejected that £60 million move, by the way, if you didn't see that. Yeah, <laughs> we've needed him. We've needed him. There were so many early goals, right? I don't mind. It's quite fun. Aziz, there's loads of space out here. They've gone the other way. Sin check, get a cross in. Back to Barrios. He's already got one assist. That's a terrible cross. It's fine. Then we pick it up. Gomez is a new man. Yeah. In New York, you can be a new man. Arojo to the byline. To Wyndell. It's good football from us. Cuisance. Arojo. Back heel. Cuisance looking for another assist. Barrios. Oh, should have been. If that's the other side, Arojo scores the header. But Barrios is not quite as good in the, end, in the air. We're 12 minutes in and we've had eight highlights and two goals it's weird it's fun though sin check ball forward for gruber's gonna get there arojo oh my god he's knocked it down to nobody uh speaking of new york watch in the heights yeah i need to i need to dan i'm sure cat will be up for it go on burns off the post oh it's cleared i love sin check right back i like him right back yeah He's pretty much... I mean, Freddie Welly's at the African Nations, but Sinchek, I think, is going to hold down that right-back spot now. Arojo hit the post. Was it Arojo, was it? Not Burns. Oh, from that header before, was it? Maybe. Uh, fancy stream until nearer 2pm. We'll see. We'll see. I'm I'm having a good time and relaxing and chilling, you know. We'll see. Depends if I need to um go and do anything. And Burns hit it too. Oh, we both hit the post, did they? I see. Sinchek feels underrated like he does everything. He's a hero. Yeah, he is underrated because he's like a jack of all trades sort of type. And he kind of covers across everywhere. Like we played him in midfield loads. He was, do you remember him and it was, I'm pretty sure it was Sinchek and um, Yoon at the back in that playoff win. In the playoff final. Like, and they were a brick wall in that game, I seem to remember. So he's been here a long time as well. Pitt. George Alexandra. We've had quite a few chances there. And now Tottenham are on the attack. Who was that? Arojo just getting breezed past. Pitt puts it wide though. You suggested it. Ollie, you did say right back. Yeah. I mean, we played in there before, but you did say for the rest of the season. He played CB at the start of the season. Scored two. Yeah, he did. He did as well. Gomez. This is good. Arojo. Oh, he's put it wide. He just kind of ambles into the box there and hits it on his right. We've had chances. All good, Leone. All good. 
Uh, prediction will be sorted later. Pause for now. Fair enough. Um, oh, we should be winning this game. We should be ahead. Let's say uh, I'm not happy. Even though I'm, I am quite happy, but don't tell them that. And we shall start the second half. What can we do from the bench? Gruber's been quiet up front. Gruber out, Gasparoni in, maybe. Or Maria or Salah. We've got options out there. Arojo, how's he been playing? Kind of quiet as well. Maybe Mario for him's the first change. Um, 6.4 from Wyndal. I'm going to do Mario. I feel like Mario can make things happen. <laughs> Let Ollie have his moment. Yeah. Well, nothing's happened second half. We've got our first highlight of that second half. Nothing has been going on. Gomez. He's been good. Is it into Aziz? Heads it. He's got to score the rebound. Yes. He could have done that thing where he lay down and nodded it in. But Aziz has made it 2-1. He's headed it off the bar and got the rebound. Lovely. What a weird. That is not the type of goal you see very often. Is it? I like it. It's a lovely ball, by the way. Imagine him missing that. There was a small moment where I thought he might, Jeff. Big header. He takes his time here. Takes a touch. Then nods it, knocks it in. Lovely. Thought he was going to Werner it. Yeah. It was, um, it's nice though. It puts us 2-1 up. Now we can make those other changes. I'm going to do Gasparoni as the other change, but I might change those around. What's the keeper doing? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Thought he was going to Werner it. Prince Aziz. We've got a highlight straight away. I haven't gone more defensive or done anything yet. I'm hoping it won't bite us now. It shouldn't. Gruber's in, but I was about to take him off. Donnarumma makes the save. I haven't won the African, Asian, South American Champions League for nothing. That's true. Oh, that's actually a highlight for the corner here as well. Towards Burns. Headed away. Cuisance. So that weird. Cuisance. To go. Pole's got it in the box. Right. Seven to go. I'll tell you what we'll do. Which one of these does this job? I think that. I think that, like that. We do this. Yeah, I think so too, Pav, potentially. I think this is what I prefer to do. This is We've done this a few times and it's been... It's worked, so we'll see. It's always one of those, like... Afterwards, you kind of think... You could have done something else. But this one, we know that this works... Headed away. <clears throat> I should drink my squash, shouldn't I? Mario. Have we got a sub left? Uh, yeah, we've got one sub left as well, right? Oh, God, they've nicked it. Nothing silly, please, Paul. Nothing silly. Oh, God, we're giving it away again. This is scary. We survived the chance and then give, gave it away again. Easy for Sunday. Nice. Nice. Uh, we've got one more sub and we are in added time. I think we make it. Let's do uh, Barrios for Baltran seems safest, I think. You could DM after this highlight. I don't think we need to. We're in added time. We do a sub. That should be it. We're good. It's a lovely, lovely away win at Spurs. Coming from behind there as well. Going down 1-0 in the fifth minute to win that. That is good. That felt like things were against us at that point, didn't it? We had all those injuries. We had the suspensions. We had, you know, a tough start to the game. But no. What great character we've shown there to come back and win that 2-1. Aziz winning it late on. Performance from the lads. Missing La Livre, Missing Jurassic. We're still missing um, a right back, aren't we? Freddie Welly's away. Like, that's a performance, that. Special lads, I've told them. Is that a point for me? Is it actually, Oli? Did you get a point? Nice. Did I not predict a 2-1 win? Um, Dan, are you doing predictions whilst Leone's not here? Is that how this is going down? I assume you've been talking about it, if that is the case. They are on hold. You are. Am I? I don't know. I just know that Leone's not here and she said predictions are on hold. So maybe we just need to know. I don't know. I'm sure it's fine. We'll sort it. Uh, Leone just paused it. She did. Yeah. I thought they paused. Okay. I, it's not up to me. I don't run these things, do I? It's not up to me. Sad times. Yeah, if you got a point there, unlucky. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, 
the uh, the leader of the predictions is uh, is 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 not here. Uh, hello, Ian. I woke up yesterday and something was different. There was a stillness, a quiet. I was confused with the grass green. I'm not reading the rest of that. Hello, Ian. <laughs> I know what it's about, and I'm not reading it. All right. Uh, get Lucas on the XLR and like he. Yeah, I should actually. That's a good one. Maybe I should just record it. And like he. And like he. There you go. Sounds better than Lucas himself. Look at the run of games, everyone. Come on. We've got West Ham away next. We are third in the league. There are 14 games to go. Are we all good this weekend? Yeah, I'm great. Thank you, Ian. Lovely, lovely stuff. Some have got to tell football where it's from. Yeah, they've just, you know, it's a bit lost at the moment. They'll beat the Czech Republic and they'll know what to do again then, though, won't they? It's fine. It's fine. We've had our, we've had our chat about the football. <laughs> a juicy wall of green. A lovely juicy wall of green, Gucci. Yes. Do you know what I say about England on Friday night? I like it. That's what I'll say. <laughs> Seemingly Boogie is, ho is home. Yeah. Boogie in a way with your one point. At the, you know, going out. <sighs> Bukayo Saka has been rejected. They won't go for it. Even though I've said that I will give them, I'll give them 40 million. They've still rejected it. Uh, name the teams who have not scored at the Euros. Yeah. <laughs> Ollie, I don't update these things. You know this. Patience. Massive three points for the Scots. Yeah. They've got it to play for. They've got it to play for in the Croatia game. They've put themselves in a the position for that. We'll see. We have a moral scout, yeah. Your point has been noted. I think Phil and Ollie got points. Was there anybody else who got points in that last game? Don't lie, because we've got the receipts. Um, and then we can make a note of it. Another loan offer for Godinez. Monaco in for Conchalves. Um... On deadline day, I think we go for that Conway left back. And I think that's how we try and do this. <laughs> Golchalva. Yeah, he's good. But like, he wants 90k a week. And he's 30. And these are going to get worse. Like, he's great. But he's not as good as Gomez. And he wants 90k a week. And he's 30. I just don't think it's... I mean, we literally can't offer him it, so... Wolves released him 18 months ago. Yeah, and he's turned into a really good player, hasn't he? Yeah. Sorry, Phil. Phil didn't. Sorry, Phil. Did Phil not get a point? Ah, oh, did he not predict it? Sorry, Phil. Thanks, Phil. I don't know why I don't say that more to you, Phil. Thanks, Phil. <laughs> Thanks for that, Phil. Love that bit. Um, Yoon wants to start more games, do you? I'm afraid, Yoon, we are winning lots of games. Can I say that to him? Is there a thing to say here, chat, that will mean that he does not get angry? Like, if I say, love, um, not lo love, I won't say that to him. If I say it means dropping somebody else, will he be okay with it? Or is there, or if he's not, if someone is in good form? Well, basically, Burns and Segovia are both in great form. Tell him you love him. Oh, I do love him. You can. Right, let's do it then. I'm meant to be an important player, but I've not been playing as much. Shall I say? Um, I'm, I'm not sure here. Tell him to lower his expectations. I'd be better if you're prepared to accept being a squad player. Where's lower your expectations? Is that one of these? Uh, oh, hang on a bit. There's way more if I scroll down. Oh, okay. So if I say Sinchek is in the form of his life, but Sinchek's not playing in his position. Leave through a trap door. Um, form of a certain player. Yeah. So is it the Sinchek one here? Sinchek's playing right back there, which is weird, but will he be okay with that? Because that's what I thought it was, but I was expecting Burns or Pole to be on here, to be honest. I could also say we're in fantastic form at the minute and can't risk disrupting that by rotating. Is like, do, will that one work? Doesn't matter, just say sin check. Okay. Uh, Inked, thank you very much for the two, buddy. That's my favorite resub. Welcome back, dude. 
dude, I've said, you know. That's, I say dude these days. That's me now. Chat, can we get some love? For Inked23, what a guy. All right, so he said he's, fair, he's found that fair enough. It makes no sense, but fair enough, he says. <laughs> yeah, see, that was my thinking as well. I thought that would be the case. But again, that's just Football Manager, one of those FM things, isn't it? Um, Arojo's trained nicely. This is good. Things are good around the club at the moment, aren't they? It's much nicer when the Hereford are winning, when we do these streams. <laughs> Let's praise your training. Like when these are all, not these, when uh, these are all good, things are things are looking nice, aren't they? Good. I mean, I thought that'd be higher than just good, to be honest. But good, excellent, excellent. You are, Rolly. You are. You're my go-to for uh, interactions. Um... Badi Ashile playing against his old team, but he's not in the team anyway, but he will be in the squad. Because Sinchek is naturally a centre-back, that's why it decided him, yeah. And will he have the highest average rating out of the others? I'd imagine so, like, recently. I guess that's how it is, does it. So, yeah, yesterday, chat, I recorded a whole series, and also, I didn't even record part two of the James Ward-Prowse, but I have... Uh, holidayed and played through until the end of James Ward Prowse's career, and there will be a part two to the James Ward Prowse video um, very soon. So it's all go. I've got videos ready to be made. Isle is not there to edit them, so I'm going to be editing them. I'm sorry, chat. I'm sorry to let you down like that, but there is some uh, videos will be here soon on the old YouTube. And if you wanna wanna click that link that he's just put in there, Dan's just put in the chat. Go and sub. Go and sub on YouTube so you don't miss it. Uh, I'll edit in the series. Some of it, definitely, yeah. When he's back. Um, unless there's anyone. Does anyone know a really good editor that wants to have a go at editing some videos for me? Let me know. Oh, yeah, Ian, we've got moving crabs now. We've got moving crabs. We've got a moving We Are Bodies. And we've also got a moving Jurassic. A moving T-Rex. I know. It's all kicking off here, isn't it? Editor Ben's pretty good. I don't think Editor Ben's got any time to do that. Um, yeah, there you go. Look, there's the Jurassic one. Uh, so we, should we go same team? I think we have to go same team, don't we? It won the game. I'm once again asking for predictions. Next Crab Rave is going to be epic. Yeah, tell you what we're going to do, though, Ian. When we raid over in about half an hour, 40 minutes, we're going to use our new Crab Raid emote and use our dancing crabs and it's going to be the best raid we've ever done it's gonna be the best raid on twitch i want whoever we raid to play crab rave because it's going to be that good and there's going to be that many crabs in the chat okay there you go like that look it's going to look like that how, how good does that look instead of crab rave it's crab raised see what i did um uh, that has definitely made it harder for Dan to get predictions, by the way. You've got all these crabs dancing, and then in the middle, you've got John saying 3-1 Hereford. <laughs> Sorry, Dan. <laughs> Alexa, play Crab Rave. Oh, God, that actually, that actually might... Sorry if your Alexa's just done that. I feel like mine might. It's not. Um, We've got no players coming back, so I think we go same team. Let's do it. End of predictions. We are playing West Ham. I think he said West Hamwich there. That's weird. West Ham away. That was probably not the best team talk there, but I think I can fix it by pumping the fists at them. Didn't expect you to say it. Yeah, no, I don't know why I did that. I found that really funny once, though. I said it once. I was like, Alexa, call mum. <laughs> and so many people called their mum. I've done it there. Oh, we've conceded early. That's my fault. Sorry, Finn. That's that's I didn't even change scene as well. This is this is my fault. <sighs> yeah, it's closed. We won the down. Ricky Ricky J Jones always either either he's brilliant against us or he's terrible. Uh, Quisons, okay. oh straight the keeper. Uh, Risky is here. Thank you for being here, Risky. Thank you for the follow as well. Hello. Oh, control by pole takes it down. Right, we came from behind against Spurs. We're going to have to try and do it again here against West Ham. 1-0 down early. From a corner as well, no less. 
Hey, from TikTok. Welcome in, Risky. I love it when people come from other places. Welcome, dude. Hope you're good. Aziz. Gruber. 1-1. One, one. Oh, what a save. What a save keeper. Welcome in, though, dude. Hope all is well. Uh, any news on when you get to win the next... I mean, when the next streamer showdown will be? Uh, next month. I believe this was just a month off just because of Euros and things. Um, and then I think... I don't actually know this. And I i don't know if I'm in it or anything like that. But I think next month the showdown will be back. Everyone loves the TikTok. TikTok's great. My name is uh, Risky. Uh, yeah, Risky, by the way. I'm Risky. Oh, on, on TikTok. Nice. I will look out for you, buddy. Uh, yeah, so Matt, I think, I think July it'll be back. But I don't know that for sure. Trying to work out what TT was. I, it took me a second. But I got there. <laughs> right, Laird's on the right-hand side. It's not been our best start in a game here. That's a missed tackle. We should... Why is the linesman put... There must have been an offside. I didn't know why the linesman was putting his flag up there. I'm hoping the showdown takes more of a break next month too. I'm getting burnt out from it a bit. I know what you mean. I don't mind the longer breaks in between, you know. Showdown has a Euro special coming soon, I heard. That is the uh, that is the rumours, yeah. I don't mind a longer break between them. Like, build it up a bit. I don't... I, I've kind of thought that from the start. Like, like a two-month break, I think, would be fine. However, there is clearly an audience for it every month. So, it's clearly working. But yeah, I, I mean, switching up sometimes, I don't think it's the worst thing. We found you in the last Schalke episode. Love that, Risky. Thank you, buddy. Gomez. Gomez, two weeks would be better. Two weeks, two a week. Wow. Barrios, 1-1. One, one. We've equalized. Come on. Did someone say showdown. You, you whisper the words, stream a showdown, and soccer with Brian appears in his car. That's uh, it, that is, that's a fact. <laughs> Welcome in, Brian. Hope you're good, buddy. How are things on your end? Two a week would be overdoing it. I think it might be, Ollie. Yeah, it might just be. Uh, Oscar, thank you for the follow. And also, Snelly, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. I hope you're good. All right, we're 1-1 one, one back. We're back level in this game, which is good stuff, considering we were 1-0 down. And they had a couple of chances. We're playing okay. I'd have a mini showdown within a showdown. I think it's too much, you know. He's the showdown genie. He is. Uh, they not let me know when it is yet. I assume I'm on the lowdown this time. Yeah, Pav, right? I've begun the coffee intake for the day, so I'm swell. Hope you and the chat are good. I am very well. I can't speak for all of the chat, but I think they're good. I think they're good. Um... I'm going to say I'm not happy. Demotivated poll. Let's fix that. What should we say to poll? Uh, I'm, <laughs> so I said to the to the whole squad, I said I'm not happy. He was not motivated by that. So I said to him one-on-one, -on -one, I'm not happy. And then he was motivated. See? Man management. Just repeat things to people one-to-one. -one. He does. He does, Ian. Exactly. Uh, Dylan, Muggy, thank you very much for the eight months. Hello, hello. Thank you for the eight, buddy. That's gone in. Sunday, man. That's That was poor. That was poor. He wanted attention Sunday, clearly. Oh, right. Paul did. Yeah, he did. And then Sunday's just let this one go in. Oh, we got back to 1-1 one, one and now we're struggling. Ugh. He's kind of padded it in there, Sunday. That's poor. Bought it first place, but I can still finish first. That's all right, Risky, then. That happens in FM. I, I know all about that. Right, corner from them's gone over. We have uh, we need to change. I don't know. Oh, Cuisance is our tired man, but I, I can't take him off because we need him. We need him for set pieces. I'll go for an encourage, which has worked well. Oh, Rojo's injured. Let's do him next then. Pen! Okay, it's not a pen. He's getting sent off. I was just talking about how I was going to... He's got sent off for a handball. I thought we were getting a penalty, but we've got a red card. Okay. 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 Well, we're going to do Barrios off then. Barrios is coming off. For, if we haven't got a midfield, I guess we do this. Let's do that and then do that. I love Arojo. That is so dumb what he's done there. We're down to 10. Oh, hang on. Go on, Gruber. Go on. It's got a lot to do here. It's 
His baby legged it. We've got a lot to do here. And I think this might be the end of our winning run. I'm going to assume it is. Because we're 2-1 down and a man down. Oh, it's not headed away. I thought we were going to maybe... Maybe... Sorry, what is that defending? All right, we've been done by a red card and a few poor individual performances. But seriously, what is this defending? They're all like in a in a cluster here. I mean, it's not good from Aziz, but look at the cluster. Someone come into this space. You can't let him run through that gap there. Like Gasparoni, I'm not sure what you're doing. So go for like, Paul, you need to come across it. What's going on? Book Sunday. He actually got a hand to that. That actually was... I don't think that's Sunday's fault. Like, in terms of FMs, that's fine. Like, the first one was its fault. Or, the, well, their second one. But that one, I don't know. Um, he had, like... He had, like, no, nobody around him. Um, I've stayed quite attacking by keeping two strikers on. But I feel like there's not much we can do. Gruber's finishing's been poor. Who are we going to change? We've got no midfielders, so... There's not much we can do here, is there? We might as well just rest for legs. George on for a point. Go on, George. 6.3, find him after the game. Yeah. 6.3 from Orojo as well. 5-2-2-2. Two, two, two. Just don't even feel like that's going to be worth it, to be honest. You need to show discipline, yeah. There's too many players. That is too many players. Maria for Mickey C. Yeah, but we haven't really got a player who can play. We could do like that. Because Cuisance is knackered anyway. Let's just do that and like... Let's just try... And like do something like weird like that. Just for the end. Can still win. I don't think we will win. But yeah. We might as well get like attacking. We might as well rest our very tired player and get people forward. We haven't really got any attackers. Uh, any midfielders to bring on. So Yoon as a midfielder is like the one change. I suppose we could put Sinchek into midfield. Send everyone forward. I, yeah. I think we do that. We just concede again. A goal here means that we... Okay, that's just terrible. We got in each other's way there. Ricky J. Jones for 4-1. I think it's going to be. It is... A bit hard with only 10 players. Yep. Yeah. We're down to 10, remember? That was just unlucky. Like, I, well, our players ran into each other there. Gomez and... Who was the other player in there? Aziz ran into each other. Generally, the best formation when down to 10 is 5-2-2. Um, we haven't, yeah, but we, we haven't got enough subs to do that, I don't think. Like, we'd have to, I don't think the players fit for it. Like, we haven't got any midfielders, and then we haven't got the right players to play in there with one sub left. Either way, we were 3-1 down. It wasn't going to, we weren't going to come back anyway. Um, all right, fair enough. We've the end. the The winning run ends there. It's not a lot we can do when we play. We go two one down, and then we get a sent off. I get a red card. So, yeah, one of them. We need to bounce back in the FA Cup. We need to win this. Really, it's a tough game. Leeds are a decent team. We play off the back of a loss now. Not going to be an easy one. We've also got a Rojo band. We'll see. I'm definitely not taking predictions serious. No, you did that to Mud George's prediction. Lovely, lovely. <laughs> Ollie always takes them serious. All right, Liverpool have won five one. Burnley are in the mud since they since we beat them. Yeah, go on. Next one of fixtures is horrible. So we got Leeds. You say that we do all right against these teams sometimes. Uh, Model Richards, you mean Rodell Richards? Is that who you mean? Uh, Leeds, United, Liverpool, Chelsea. Yeah, we've not made it easy for ourselves. Kyle George to Wolves, by the way, fifteen mil. Real life, Pav. Nice. They love a Portuguese. Is he Portuguese? They love a Wonder Kid, though. Uh, in Season 9, don't know if he'll be good. Uh, he's all right on our save. This was pre-patch. This is like when the game first dropped, so he's not quite as good on this build. Um, but no, he is good. He is good. He was just like an obvious one that I um, 
I try tend to avoid like the really obvious signings. Gomez linked with a 64 million pound move to Ajax now. He's Brazilian, yeah. I thought that as I said it, I was like, that makes it Portuguese speaking. You know what I meant. I know you had Dane Scarlett. Yeah, we had we had Pavad Rodal Richards. We had the chance to sign him, and because I just didn't really want to do the same thing. Um we had Dane Scarlett and he was terrible. <laughs> Awful. But very good on FM since that point. All right. <clears throat> Leeds in two days. We kind of need to do the promise for um, La Livre. Otherwise, he's going to get upset. But I don't think this is the game to do it. When is stadium move day? June, I think. I believe it's June and... I'll look for the exact date. It is in here somewhere. 25th of June. Look how close we are. Look at the line. We're close to the stadium being built. Yeah, I promised him adva um, advanced playmaker. And I can't do anything about it. And he's a little bit upset about it already. Look. Very concerned. Badia Chile is also upset that I've not improved the coaching team, even though I did. That's the point. Belgian man AM, yeah. He won't care if you finish top four. Yeah, I hope not. We've got 100 days left. So in May. So actually, do we finish the season? But yeah, it's on the last day of the season that we've got to get it done. I hope not. We'll see. I guess it's the end of the season anyway, so we've got like the window to sort it out. But I feel like I can't really play him there without changing too much. And I don't want to change too much. So we're just going to have to cop for it, I think. Yeah, Belgium man, that's his name. Um, Goretzka to Chelsea. Goretzka, by the way, I was doing that James Ward Prowse video. Goretzka, you saw it in the first one, won uh, the Ballon d'Or in that. Take part. Should I take part? Because we need to look for a left back. Should we see if um, Saka's now interested in coming in at left back? What are these? Just left backs that are interested. Why are Wolves fans annoyed they're going for young players rather than old men? Um. Uh, not sure. Just look at transfer list if you can. Yeah, these. this is the transfer list. Oh, Kieran Tierney's been listed. We'll take a Kieran Tierney. We won't take a Kieran Tierney because I'm not paying two million for him, but he's listed. That's kind of useful. Talking Wolves are big time these days. They are, yeah. <laughs> oh, they're still saying no to that. Um, to try again for Conway. I don't think I can. I can't afford that, can I? The, the club. Well, that Tini can play right back. Apparently, can he? You can't beat them. Join them, eh? <laughs> yep. Um, would never put him there. No. Will this go through? So say we've got 263k. If we signed him for this, would this actually happen? Would it go through? Like, because is that enough? Because it's monthly contribution of 308. Surely, like, would this get cancelled is what I'm asking. Or because... Because we've got 32 million there, would it be all right? Oh, Lenny's up. <laughs> Do you want to see him? Look at him. He's up and about, everyone. Lenny. Hello. Not sure what he's doing. Putting a buy clause of like 100 mil. Can you take off the fee? Um, I don't think they, they'll accept if I take off the fee. We can try it. Oh, no, I can't do future fees. Um, oh, let me undo that. He's really not impressed with you. No, he hates this thing that he's wearing. He hates it. No, I can't take it off because I'm not allowed to offer it. Look, future fees cannot be set if this player has less than a year left. He's going out of contract, so I can't do it. Um, I could tell him he's going to be a star player. He won't be, but I could say that. He's turned his back on me. He has. Hang on a minute. Where's he gone? 
Is he on the move? Aslan is on the move. I would turn I would turn his back on you. That, that doesn't make sense, Ollie. Uh, let me just take the cut. Can you take Lenny out for a wee? Please. He's by the door. Okay. Um, take out terminated. What? Take out terminated. Oh, loan cannot be ter cannot be terminated. Um, oh yeah, so they can. Oh yeah, they might accept it. Then you mean? What? Put zero. No, they want it. Um, can I do a budget adjustment? Oh. We'll be over wages, but I can actually probably afford it. Should I just do this? What a lovely romantic test. Because I know, right? I could do that. Just see if it lets you. Just... We might as well try it, right? It's deadline day. We're going to get our, We're gonna get the feedback. They'll, they'll answer us straight away, right? Been accepted. Let's just see if it works. Is he even good? Didn't he? Didn't see him. Um, I don't know. <laughs> He's all right. He's pretty good. He's going to be a backup left back. And like, then he does go out of contract in the summer. So we could just get him another one. Worth asking the board for a budget increase. Battlefront, we've got no money. So I think they're going to say no. We actually, in this window, we asked for more wages and they gave it to us. So um, unfortunately, they, they're, they're just going to say no. Is he five foot three? Is he actually? Yeah, we missed that then if he's five foot three. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome in, Will. Hope you're good. Is he actually five foot three? Um... Cat's come and got him. He's all good. Warwick Davis at left back. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, he is five foot three. He's got a jumping reach of five. Might have misread. No, he is five foot three. It's fine. Don't discriminate. Can you just please just let me have him? I'll give you like 120 million. I won't. That is optional, right? That is optional. I'm on my break, but I feel like I'm eating sandpaper. Um, right. That why? Conway, uh, so I can adjust the budget. Should I just get this done? Shall I just get this done? He costs about a million and then he will be out of contract. So we can probably just sign him permanently and he'll be, a, I reckon, 22 year old left back. It's not a bad option anyway. I think we might as well just get this done. And hopefully we get all the money from Alamelli, hopefully getting a bit of a bigger, um, put that money for Saka. What do they want for Saka's money? Is Saka better? I could try it. I reckon they'll reject it anyway. Um, I think we just do this, to be honest. I think they reject the Saka one anyway, to be honest. And I think we just do that. Do it. Put it in the microwave, Will. <laughs> you got a, you got a delay? I have got a delay. Saka's on so much more. Saka's wages currently are four. No, he's not that much more. Like, we're paying him 36 anyway. He's not that much more. I would still be under the wage budget anyway. That's good. 3.5k is a lot. Yeah, someone walked in the staff room. That would be very hard to explain. Um, hmm. Can I delay? If I delay here, I can still do it in this window, right? You can just delay for a sec. Yeah, okay, good. I just don't want to like delay it and then ruin it. And then let's just see if they reject the Saka one and then we'll do it. They haven't rejected it immediately. Hello, Callum. Welcome in. They, yeah, they're okay. They've rejected the Saka one. I can't even suggest terms, which is annoying. Right, I think we, I think we just get it done for, uh, for Callum. Six, five foot three Conway. I actually can't ask for the confirmation. Um, I have to wait for it. Do little little Conway is gonna be brought in as our backup left back. Little five foot three little Conway. <laughs> um okay. Still haven't got the confirmation. Will this go all the way up until the deadline for this? I think it might. And hopefully Alamele plays some games for um is he back in France for um 
Lorient, isn't he? If he is he playing games? Because if he is, hopefully that reputation will boost up a bit and he'll get a bit more value. Oh, Saint-Etienne, sorry. He's played his first game, got a 6.1. He's probably not going to play any more games now because he's terrible. Yeah, we've got six foot six pole next to five foot three Conway. I love it. Okay, can we get confirmation now? Why would you put the kitchen foil in the microwave? Early finish from work. Right, probably not worth it. Death. D don't do that. Hey, Phil. Forgot to share this. 21 months from Phil. Come on. Love that. Thank you, Phil. Thank you for the two gifted today. And then just doing your resub. Appreciate it. Uh, try Tierney quick. Uh, I, I suppose I could try Tierney really quickly. Let's just see if there's anybody else added there. Did Tierney move? No, he's still there. Dave Azapard is still on there. They want 120k for him. I don't really want to pay 120k. I don't want to pay those wages too much. You didn't even look at Nuno Tavares. I didn't, did I? I will look now. That's not him. There he is. He's okay. Feels like a very long time since the last show. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. It's because we weren't in the last one as well. So it feels slightly longer for us. Um, all right. Mario in for the suspended Arojo who got himself sent off. La Livre is back in. This is a FA Cup game, but I do want to go strong for it, I think. I want to go pretty much full strength just because I want to go through. I kind of want to try and win the FA Cup and I think we can. But we do need to get past Leeds here first, obviously. Um, so we go pretty much full strength, just Mario in. And then we are missing Jurassic, obviously, up front too. I think we do that. Ro Arojo red card is in cup game. Yeah, that's true. That is really true. Right, we're doing that. I don't think anybody did, did any assists. Play the 4-2-3-1. Um, nah. Next match only. We're going to do this. Let's show what the world, what the world, what this team is all about, apparently. In a FA Cup fourth round game. Showing the world. Um, bet his crap so it'll be fine. Didn't even... Oh, yeah. He, he wasn't great anyway. He was okay, actually, that Nuno Tavares. Not great, though. All right, here we go. They are not playing Savio. I feel like their team's quite different. Have they rested a fair few? I feel like they might have done. Savio's not there, and I don't recognize that many of their players. They haven't sold Savio, have they? I need to use the next match only feature more. It's good, isn't it? The next match only feature. Mario into Cuisance. Put it wide. That's a chance. The whole world watching Hereford versus Leeds in the next yeah. You enjoy the Belgian hating you. Well, even if I play the 4-2-3-1, that role there won't be an advanced playmaker, so I probably wouldn't do it anyway. We're gonna we're gonna hope that we finish top four and he's happy with us anyway. That's what we're going for. More about <laughs> I love how people just, like, whenever anyone makes a mistake with their typing, like a typo, people just repeat it back to them. The most teachers chat in the world. Barrios, lovely run around the houses. Oh, goes down. Roberto Renato Carlos concedes the penalty. We're going to have a pen here. Unless the referee snakes us. Darren Hallahan is going to give a penalty, which is going to be taken by... Gruber. Not Cuisance. We're bad from pens. I think we miss 80% of our penalties. 80%. We scored from the corner anyway. Go on, Gruber. There was a thing where my phone was corrected. Soz to Diz like three teams in a row. Not lived it down yet. Yep. Come on. Straight away, Cuisance gets the assist. Gruber heads in. He's not even good. He shouldn't really be on that near post. He's only there because he's in for Jurassic. I know why he's in the wrong place. He scored the header anyway. How tall is he? He's got 12 jumping reach. I'm scoring headers from corners. It's fine. It's 1-0. We lead. Beautiful. 
make Mickey C first choice now. I probably should, shouldn't I? I won't do it now. I need to do it after the game so that we um so that we don't I'd have to do it again else, won't I? Um I just want to do this. Um That should not be you. You can go there, unless you're taller. You're fine on that side. Wonder Kid now is um, our guru, but is he actually a Wonder Kid now? Is he listed as that? He's good, any group, huh? Missed the penalty, but he's made up for it by scoring very early. I'm going to praise them. Gomez demotivated. He'll be fine. Cuisance is knackered. I feel like we need him for the set pieces. Let's keep him on for a while, but he is very tired. 20 to go. I think it is time we do need to swap him. Um... I'm going to do this. Mickey C needs a proper nap. He does. Get a Z's on. Oh, my God. Pepe. Oh, I'm going to have to now because Gomez has just gone knackered. Did he get a knock there or something? Dun, 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 dun. I'm going to do this, I think, for the end. Gasparini's pretty good in that, actually. He does a job. Eight minutes to go. Five minutes to go. Who else is knackered? Uh, Barrios for Beltran. Bit of legs on the right-hand side. I'd be unmotivated being managed by this crab. Lovely. Two minutes to go. We should, and we are, safely through to the fifth round of the FA Cup. It's a 1-0 win. Gruber missed a penalty, and then from the resulting corner, heads in the winner. Excellent. Excellent. The rain is meant to stop literally for the next two hours of the race. Love that. Um, and we are through to the fifth round. Gruber with the winner. Good stuff. A good win, boys. We take those. We absolutely do take those, don't we? Was that the fifth round? I think that's the fourth. Um... Yeah, that was the fourth round. We've They've drawn the fifth round. I can't remember who it was. Sheffield Wednesday? Yeah, we've got a championship team in the next round as well. So we can go all out there. That should take us through to a quarterfinal if we can navigate our way through that. We'll be in a good good place there, actually. Um, yeah, they just drew the fifth round really early this year for some reason. I don't know if that was different or not. Maybe they do that. I don't know. But yeah, that is a good, a good old result i'm happy with that it also means we bounce back from that weird loss against west ham where we had the red card didn't really perform in amongst all these wins we've kind of bounced back from what is going to be a horror run next time of manchester united liverpool chelsea before sheffield wednesday we might need to is there any gaps between those we we might need to play cadbury the chocolate boys a couple of times during that run we'll see we probably won't but we'll see um we get 200k from that as well we just need oh look Kofi's moved to Charlton. What's Kofi up to these days? We love Kofi. He's been at, been on loan at Charlton where he scored some goals in the championship. He's been at, back at Brighton. Now he's moved. Go on. You got a big gap. Yeah, there was four to two week gap. It must be a um a international one. Uh, thanks for the great stream. See you around. Bay, thank you for hanging out. Thank you for, uh, you dropped a follow today. So I appreciate you sticking around for the whole stream. Thank you, dude. Thank you for everybody else who came in today for the first time if it's your first time we've got a couple of minutes left but we will uh start to think about our um our raid in a second um i just want to end this window now Ballet. let's see if we get okay. this conway guy in before we finish winter break oh it's the winter break is it there you go then what me. Okay. oh thank for the follows harry and finn thank you for the follows. they've they've cancelled it even though i could adjust Oh, we don't have a left back. That's your fault. That's your fault for trying to make me get a sacker. It's got no... A lone move might beat the deadline. You have an hour. Loan request denied. Yeah. Not me. Nah, 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 I'm not having this. I'm not having this calling me a tit. No, not me. I said... I was ready to do that. And you guys said, no, try for Saka. Delay it. We're going to try again. Unit left back season. Try about five. 
Yeah, what other ones could we get? We might as well get a couple of other loans set up just in case that one doesn't go through. What about Dave Azapazi in on loan till the end of the season? He's really, he's right-footed. Uh, we try again for Saka. It's going to be even more money. A loan move could beat the, could beat the deadline. How much is that? 1.5 mil. They're going to reject that anyway, aren't they? Any foreign? Um, and, and adjust the budget now. Good idea. Uh, let's look for work permit ones as well. Bravo or Woba. Oh, Sirachi's there. I like Sirachi. I like Sirachi as a player. They don't want to loan him. They're not willing to listen to offers for a loan. Okay, that's not happening then. The foreign ones won't be able to get to board the plane in time. I don't know if that's how it works, but you're right. They probably wouldn't be able to do it, would they? Good source, yeah. Uh, Woba maybe. You can look loan listed as well. Yeah, I will. Right, let's try and get this done. Let's try and get something through the door. I feel, you know, when like at the end of like a, a deadline day, you know, on like um, Sunderland till I die. That's basically me right now. Okay. Um, they're reluctant to let him leave. So right, I can only pay 40, I can pay 40K of his wages. Get the faxes in, exactly. Uh, thank you for the follow, Josh, as well. Just make a, make a bid there. All right, well, no worries, Will. Enjoy the rest of your work. Dude. Dude. Gone for dude there. What about you? Are you good? You're, you're good. Why has he got such a low one of them? You're quite good. Moldovan, lad. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. This one's got potential, and he looks all right. He plays for Narnia. Would you... Yeah, that can happen, Brian. Or Brain. Brain. Brian. It's about Brian. Shadow. I'll go with that. He looks okay. That's a backup left back. Is that enough? What about Jordan Amavi? Villa legend. Brian the Brain. Yeah, that something like that. <laughs> One more. Yeah, I'm on loan list now. This guy's loan listed, this bellow. See, he's, I mean, cheap. I saw it the first time, Brewster. We'll see. I haven't looked who's on yet. Um, tackling seven. That is true. Antonio. Not very good. Mark Griffin. Not very good. I feel like we just need an, 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 a, a player, though. All right. Let's see what we can do. We've got 50k in the wage budget. When did that happen? Did I move the players to there or something? I'm not sure when that happened. Um, right, Conway accepted. Narnia guy accepted. Bello accepted. All right, we've got three loan bids accepted here. That's been... Didn't adjust the budget. Didn't, didn't adjust the budget. To be fair, I'm not sure why... I didn't get the chance to adjust the budget. I actually don't need to adjust the budget either, I don't think. I don't think I can. Maybe because I can't. I could. I don't know why I didn't get the option to. Okay, we're not getting a lone left back then. That That's the end. 45 minutes, you bloody tit. Well, no, I thought we'd get the option to. We got the option to the first time. Move it up. Well, there's no point. We've got 30 minutes. I don't think it happens now, does it? Delaying was a mistake and go for Narnia. I, do you reckon we can get... I don't think it happens now. I think it's too late. One more one more continuing that the, it ends, doesn't it? You'll seem... Since you'll seem very accomplished at the game. Are you serious? <laughs> are, you, are you watching this right now? <laughs> it still says a loan move could meet... Could, could, could do the deadline. It's been accepted. We've got 15 minutes to go. It's been accepted. 15 minutes to go. No, oh, it got cancelled. 
<laughs> so close. So close. We've just run out of time. <laughs> Imagine we managed to do that. <laughs> Look, no one else is having can having their transfers cancelled. No, but just us. Trying to sign a left back. You and left back. You and, you and Paul are going to have to play left back now. Right. Amazing. Amazing. Right, chat. A certain Mr. Phil FM has gone live. He's playing football manager today. So we are going to raid across the Phil. It's a Sunday tradition. It's been a while since we've done this. What I would like you to do before we raid across is to please copy and paste what Nopfler has just put in the chat. And I want us this to be the best raid on Twitch. I want crabs. I want crab raids. I want everybody involved. Let's spam his chat with all of these crab things. Copy and paste what you can see above my head there. Them. Them crabs. If you're a sub, get involved. I want crabs, yes. I want the best raid on Twitch. Are you ready? Are you ready to make to make a beautiful thing happen? Yeah? Be ready. I will click the button when we are ready. I will see you all, though, gang, very, very soon. I'll see you next week, Wednesday, for the next stream. Thank you for hanging out. It's been a really fun stream. Lots of great results. Lots of fun. I'll see you soon. Go and go um go and go and sub on YouTube. That's the other thing to do because there's some videos soon. Are we ready? Can I get a ready from everyone? Are we ready? See you in a bit. Come on. Loads of crabs, yeah? Bye.